I did not realize that's what he said. I did not. He said something along those lines. Oh, well, how yeah, then? I do see he just came online, so. You know, worst case scenario is we reload. I don't. Yep. There's a him problem. No, it's not a him problem, it's an astro problem. <laughs> Okay, the, we will head to Rykad Majoris uh, first. Safely in the, uh, whatever system it's yes, in. yes, very <laughs> funny. <laughs> I understood the joke the first time, you know. We will head to Rykad Majoris first. Yep. Hey. Ooh, a Lord Zeno's <laughs> thing. Augers notice a large object among the lifeless rocks covering the planet. A void ship whose signature and origin are impossible to identify from orbit is resting on the edge of a deep ravine. The hull of the unidentified vessel is severely damaged. Rocks around it shattered by the force of gigantic machines crash landing. The augers haven't detected any vital sword signs aboard or near the vessel. Well, I'm going to go ahead and send a squad to the planet to explore the void ship. Nah, uh, we the... just leave. <laughs> yeah, we just leave. Um, the landing party reports via Vox as soon as they touch down, the colossal void ship before them is covered with spikes. It resembles a morbid beast sculpted from darkness itself. Menacingly hanging over the ravine, an experienced veteran accurately determined the origin of the unholy vessel. It belonged to the Xenos race called Drakari. Ready to collapse at any moment, the void ship emits a, a long, woeful creak, as if promising to drag along into the abyss below anyone who dares to disturb its slumber. Um... Yeah, let's go. Yeah, let's go get it. We have. Uh. 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 I am tempted to say that. Uh. Their head screaming, repeating words, harbinger, darkness, and death. Not wanting to tempt destiny, the rogue trader says the reason. Nah. Um, can we do multiple? Do you know, Michael? <laughs> I don't know, because I went the give me everything well. Hmm. Very in Kane could end up doing either taking the valuables or or figuring out what they're doing. What, are you getting paid to think? Yeah. I pay good. everybody. We need yeah, treasure. Well, um, you might get something out of figuring out what they're doing in system. Yeah, I want to do that first. Uh... Uh, after two wa uh, watches of hard labor, the workers managed to stabilize the Drakari void ship. The soldiers who entered the vessel were met with lifeless bodies of Xenos who had died from when the void ship crashed. The void ship itself, following its abominable la nature, come to life, immediately craving to sate its wicked appetite for human death. The vessel systems have reacted to the intruders, and senselessly cruel deadly traps have activated on all decks. We received some stuff anyways from them. And we succeeded in agility test. Uh, monstrous contraptions designed to mince, rip apart, and incinerate their victims took the soldiers by surprise, but were neutralized before the squad suffered significant losses. Soldiers found several curious pieces of Xenotech on the sinister void ship, but no data that could shed any light on why it came to the Rykad system. So we got some barbed needles, some shatter shards, a piercing splitter cannon, or splinter cannon, and experience. Okay. Was that it? Uh, I believe so. Go back. That and was indeed it. Go back to the ship. Go go back and see if there's anything you can. Re, uh, you know, no, it's gone. Yeah, that's it. Now, in our inventory, if you will look here, we have a Jukoi weapon. Yeah. Yeah. I'm aware. <laughs> I don't see anything else in the Rykad planet, so, so I'm gonna it. do. Uh, take take out Prometheus and replace him with whatever uh, NPC. Uh, I'd say Albert or Ajinta or Ithila. Something like this, right? We'll do it. 
Just we'll do I uh, idea. Um, there's like I'm NPC interaction you can have with the uh, glass, I believe. Do you remember which one does? I'm assuming it's them, a mirror. All of them have it. It's just oh. that you're only bringing the one. I'm saying there's one interaction. Okay. Well, I'm going to talk to the person and see if that's it. If not, I'm going to say we forget about you the can fact that they are down to the right. bottom and see if they uh, don't have anything to say now about the lens. Yeah, we'll do that. And that is all we'll do on this planet. If we don't find it then, <clears throat> then I'm giving up on looking for this point of interest. Yep, I couldn't find it. If anymore. everybody else is okay with that. Um I, I do have a rank before. available now, apparently, and everybody else does, so I... Oh, wait, I need to give everybody their roles. Don't worry about so, it. You don't, you don't have to give it to us yet. Well, you can level your characters, so... Uh, I can't give Michael his, though. Uh, it's fine. No. So... Okay. And wait, I'll give why Kaylee am I able the to take priest. the sharpshooter skill again? Oh, because it's silly. The person okay, so isn't there one? anymore. Uh, Oh, no, you can't. Okay. And I need to level up myself. Um, it was all a silly trick. Somewhere, somehow, the sharpshooter skill disappeared from my tree. Um. But you did just reset them, didn't you? That I did, but I made sure everything was good. I thought. No. Um. This is now fixed. Every night. Am I? I need to figure out what my next thing is. Hold up. Oh, did they actually leave? Did who leave? The um, other guy. Yeah, she's there. gone. Yeah. Oh, uh. Sure. Um. I don't either. Um, let me check something real quick. I want to see what I might want here. Um, can make them weaker at dodging. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is enforce reality, which means that when I use a heroic act, it'll decrease veil degradation by five, since we have been using lots of Psyker abilities. Uh, I just think that's a smart idea to do, you know. Increase my intelligence, and we are set. So we have the one place to check real quick. And I guess we could do a quick check inside the barracks, and then I say we give up on this planet otherwise. I don't hear any anybody opposing that idea, so it sounds good to me. Sounds what? Good. I am surprised Heinrichs didn't have anything to say about that Zeno or about the Drakari. I don't see anything else. Here. I don't see anything in here. We'll check the barracks and move on. Unless this has anything. Okay, yeah, no. We'll check the barracks and move on. Double check to make sure... There isn't anything we're forgetting. It does not seem like it. I do believe that it might be a glitch that it says this is a point of interest. Either that or it's Google really searching. well hidden. I have not, because I don't want to spoil anything. But, you know, that makes repeat playthroughs all the more interesting, so... 
What's the name of this place? The Reichhead Philia. Oh. Spell Philia. Uh, P H I L I A. What a strange combination of words. Oh, I found a place where the camera falls. Can where I get it to it? do it again? Oh, it's because there's a cliff. I see. Go to like the, like, kind of the opposite corner of the buildings. I wonder. I know if you see anything, Eck. I'm Woo. reading because I don't care about spoilers. It does draw really far. <laughs> yeah, it startled me at first. I thought I was going to lose my camera. Wee. Okay, whatever. I'm not able to find anything major. I will assume that it's a visual bug. Because I, I couldn't find anything else in Rykhead, uh Philia here, the you know? Happened to me in the, beta. the only difference is the person was still here. in the chat, Echo. Jeff said, let's move back to Rykad Minoris. Oh my god, it's the Echo. Have we been to the bunker, too? What bunker? There's a bunker, the starport, oh, yes, and... we have. That's what the, uh, governor is. Ah. So then, let's go ahead and remove Adira and re-put Prometheus back in. Getting that extra level is going to be nice for whatever encounter we have here shortly. <coughs> yeah. Another encounter? Who would have thought? We still have to talk to the tech priest we saved. We do, yes. And uh, I need to give the roll over. Yep, That's I'll give that roll over. Dude, Michael, you're at the very bottom of the list. You have to wait. <laughs> who wants to who wants to control Heinrichs? Who no way get that inquisitor away from me. Eck? Sure, I'll do it. Feel free What's to level him as well. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> What is Heinrich's voice? Uh, I don't completely remember because we just kind of met him. Um, I'm not sure if you're interested, Kaylee, but uh, that we do have a pinpoint visor that might be up your alley. Oh wait, that cancel the level up on Ooh, on Heinrich's. Okay. Because um. Astra is gonna take him. Uh, yeah, the pinpoint <clears throat> visor gives you extra crit chance uh, to range attacks with enemies that have less than 50% wounds. Ooh. I, I have exited the, the thing. Perfect. Where is it? And I will... It is in the accessories. It would replace your helmet. That's okay. Victor doesn't uh, need a helmet. So let me open up cooperative mode and get Astro sent. Now, Astro, we did we did do one thing while you were gone. If Astro is actually here. Go on. We uh we went and visited the weird 
unidentified void ship on Rykad Majoris and found out what it is a Drakari ship. Yep. And Just... then we we went to examine what it was about. Uh, traps went off. Agility check was successful. And we stole some stuff and didn't find out why they were there. Hmm. But I'll go autopilot and I'll hit continue. Hold on, I gotta back out. But I, I have a feeling that our, our dear old Inquisitor pal ha has a. Uh, that might have a, a reason for being here related to that. If you I can had never to trust Inquisitors, guess. man. Now, why would you say that? I know one personally. If anyone What's wrong with Inquisitors? With... They ask too many questions. That's What's a job. What's asking questions? Because regardless of what your answer is, you're a heretic either way. No. No. It's only if you say the wrong answers. Every answer is the wrong answer when it comes to an Inquisitor. If they're asking you questions, it's already over. That's not no. necessarily true. Actually, it really does depend on the, uh, on the Inquisitor, but well, that's very much not necessarily and true. And depending on where you're standing. The, yeah, Inquis yeah. the Inquisitor that I know is completely intolerable of heresy, therefore. Just don't be a heretic. Yeah, but they tend to see heresy when it isn't there. I mean, they've accused me of heresy before, which is just ridiculous, honestly. Alright, the best way to not get inquisitized by an Inquisitor, be a street urchin. They don't care about you. There you go, Astro. Level your character, and Michael level your character, and we'll be set to to go ahead and and head to the thing. Uh, no! Oh, you lied to me. Well, <laughs> I have high intellect, which is a sin in the Imperium of Mankind. Ryan, why have you done this to me? Because I misclicked. It's always the mis. Uh, K. Well, actually, no. Don't do this yet, Kaylee. Don't I was gonna what? have you open you the gate. About? I was gonna have you open the gate, uh, but I don't want to pull them out again. Fine, maybe I won't. Well, I want you to, just not right now. No, no, I understand. Now, Kaylee, might I recommend you also throw on, just because you can, some consumable items like grenades. Ooh. Um, Because yeah. even if you don't use them, it doesn't hurt to have them in a pinch. I'll take a fur grenade and a gas grenade. Okay, Kaylee, quick what? question. I got pyromancy, pyromancy on this guy. What's the next step up? Next step up. Like you get like what do you should get after you get pyromancy? Like lazy body of flames, uh, rentless uh, blade. Uh depends on what you're going for. Are you gonna be a melee pyromancy? Yeah. He, I want a melee okay, armor for real. He he has fifty weapon skill. He is more built for melee. So burning blood? Yeah, something like that. Alright. So, basically, set myself on fire, go crazy. Uh, do you have orchestrate flames yet? No! <laughs> well, mm. I got pyromancy. It's gonna be very important for you to get orchestrate flames, and I think you get ignite automatically, but yeah, orchestrate flames is gonna be very good for... you being a melee psychic. Okay. Oh god, I didn't... No, okay. okay. Forget the one day. Michael's still working on his... How silly. Oh. Kaylee, I have a gift for, for, uh, Senor Pascal. Senor hey. Pascal? Uh, yes. Oh, good Go heavens, ahead. I've accidentally clicked something. 
Go ahead, go ahead and take the operator gloves for the tech use. I don't need them with him being around. I'll find other back. gloves some other time. Very well, thank you. Huh, he looks so silly now. He looks red and green. He's the Christmas tech priest! Terrifying. <laughs> Even his syringes match the red and green. I mean, there's yeah. a turquoiseish blue there, but is that blue? Yeah, that's blue. It is. That's blue. Hey, it has the a color slight. Of the right now. It has a slight hint of green in it, but it is blue. It looks mostly green to me, but all right, if you say so. The bottom one. Yeah. It's mostly blue. It's like a teal. Nah. It's like Perry the platypus color. What color is Perry the platypus? Teal. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm joking! I'm joking! I'm joking. Mostly. I know who Perry the platypus I don't know who Perry the platypus is. I know of Perry the platypus. We can't keep fedora. getting away with this. And Throw yet, I do every day, Astro. And there's nothing you can do. Nothing! Throw a throw a fedora on it, and all of a sudden it becomes Perry the Mechadendrite syringe. <laughs> Why does the right, so fedora go. matter? Why does the fedora <laughs> because change? Perry, yeah. Because because Perry the platypus wears a fedora. I need the and Dr. Oh, sorry, what? Doctor Doofenshmirtz doesn't recognize Perry the platypus without his fedora. I need I need like. I, I need this kind of uh, dynamic with Vulcan and his sunglasses snake, please. And that's up to everyone else. It's hilarious. Do you want me to How's the leveling going, you? Michael? I'm thinking yet. Yeah. I think I'm gonna do this so I can use oh. both my weapons. That was fast. Oh, I can open the gate. Yeah. No. Oh, no, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> I said what I said. <laughs> I'm a psyker. I I mind linked with them to do that. See, that's what I meant. Tell him. <laughs> don't say a word. He's the captain. As of now, I'm an inquisitor, so that don't mean nothing to me. Oh, my apologies, inquisitor. Well, I didn't even mean to speak to you. You are an inquisitor. No. Associate. See. Yeah. So don't you mean don't nothing worry. to me. You're an inquisitor associate, but. That's just suspicious, honestly. It's like you're an Inquisitor, but you're trying to cover it up. I mean, kind of. Yeah, they, yeah they, exactly. Yeah, I don't trust them. They have the power, the, the authority of an Inquisitor, I'm pretty sure, but they I have the um, power of one. I have no no reason to doubt him right now, but he doesn't seem to like Adira. I always have a backup plan. Adira yeah, is unsanctioned. Yeah, yeah I'm aware. Yeah, those unsanctioned psychers, man. <clears throat> okay, fellas, be careful not to... ...the right way. No, that's the other guy. Are we not supposed to talk to him? You can. Talk to him. I'm gonna wait over here then. Okay. Ow. Just need to talk yeah, I... Uh, I'll walk through the electricity when it's electrocuting. Oh, that's fine. I just clicked yeah, over I, near Kane, so I didn't like. I would suggest being very cautious about that, for you will get wounds like you all have. And like Katie has three of them. One in half. Um, let's go ahead and talk hey. to the tortured tech priest. I need to get another robot voice of flowing. Hold up, fellas, unless somebody else wants to take it. I don't got a robot voice. Uh, nah, go ahead. Okay. We'll throw this on 64. Uh, Square, right? In the cycles of the foreordained, there lurks a flaw of worship. Uh, the tech priest's body convulses, pained, plaintive creaks of binaric prayers come from his vox as moments pass. The signal comes less and less clear, as if something twisted and wrong were being added to it. Uh, right, uh, his voice, which I did not modify yet. Uh, Pascal studies the tech priest's face carefully. His vox systems moan in a tragic vibrato. 
Subject unidentified. This is not the Blessed Amanat. Stranger, I request your name. How do you know my mentor's motto? Uh... Do you know him, Pascal? The subject has not been identified and has no record in my catalog. Interrogation is impossible due to the subject's evident effective state of clouded consciousness. Just say no. <laughs> Negative. I'll examine I am him before unable I ask. to affirm that statement. Uh, there are deep burns all over his flesh and the skin around his augment or augment augmentics. I've never Augmentics. heard of pronounced. Okay, that's weird. Uh, is charred. Blasphemous spells have been carved into his sacred iron, forming unholy litanies of scrap code. It is amazing how robust this tech priest's life support systems have proven to be in maintaining the spark of life in his grievously wounded body. Who are you, uh, servant of the Omni Sire? I have to switch back to the other one. Hold up. <gasps> what? The name. The fire of the hearth sent forth sparks. The name of this spark is Abel Hanuman. What in Hanuman? How? Uh, the tech priest looks over at Pascal for a brief moment. His speech becomes clear. Uh, the echo of my call has reached you. Good. The iteration is at its end. The design is fulfilled. You did it. Gosh darn it, hold up. <laughs> what is the intention? Why are you calling yourself by my name? Was it you who summoned me to Rakan Menorse? What for? I categorically demand an answer. Pascal's voice rises to an intimidating howl, but the delirious tech priest does not seem to understand what he is saying. You know, he was flipping that volume dial or knob right there. Yeah. Um. Ask him about the armament. Or armament, sorry. You came here because of him, after all. Gosh darn it. No, the tech priest's sweet voice grows stronger. He came because of himself. <laughs> Myself. Oh, wait. I, I did the wrong. I flipped the voices. <laughs> I did. Oh, good heavens. Myself. To redeem myself. To correct a mistake. Possibly. But how do you. Uh, there's a look of gentle condon uh, condensation in condensed <laughs> <laughs> condensation in Abel's eyes. Strange, given the circumstances, the hubris of the mind spurs him to build monuments to himself. Do not forget, regret, for all is predetermined by the iteration. A devastate, uh, devastating coughing fit cuts him off, and you hear a clang of tearing metal from inside his chest. We should ask what design. He's still getting shocked. That's yeah, fine. Th all right. yeah, what I... design? <laughs> he might be a heretic by now, for all who know. I, I'm kidding. Um, An invention both bold and honorable. To open new gates for the watchers of knowledge and comprehension. A plan written so that the righteous may follow. And trust in a great pattern of revelation and uniform progression toward it. Pascal's voice is trembling with elation. Those are his words. I have not heard them in so very long. You can talk once we get him out of here. A cold pre- No, wait, wrong one. A cold premonition rakes the heart. The probabilities are dark and frightening. Brother, I do not wish to gaze into them.
We are the flame of knowledge that draws the darkness away. Pascal is quickly inspecting Abel's wounds, paying no, or paying no mind to the blood and get sacred. Help. No. <laughs> 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 Unjin staining his sleeves, his vox wraps, and rasps smoothly. Do not fear what is to come, brother. We are already there, or here. Nobody came to my aid. <laughs> Did I know the word? As soon as you touch the wood? <laughs> As soon as you touch the tech priest, or as soon as you touch the tech priest battered flesh, he shifts his gaze to you and says with sudden clarity, "Many spar, many sparks have gone out, but not all. The electric shepherds are alive in the darkness. I heard their prayers. Find them, save them, recite the hymn of contact, sir, er, of contact circuit restoration." So that you may behold what is hidden. A blast of the motive force runs down the tech priest's body and his face contorts in a mocking grimace. Malformed binary code repulsively jarring on the ears pours out of his vox. Um... Information archived to the effect that this cir er, circuit restoration hymn is the entrance password of the Electro Priest's hiding place. Pascal res er, responds with dour rhythm rhythms of containment Araya. Uh, I note with great sorrow that the cultist ritual has been partially successful. My tech brother has been tainted by corruption. He is in the grip of a sch uh, schism schismatical. An unholy imitation of the machine spirit. I request immediate activation of the tech sorcerism protocol. He just said what the schismatical was. No, he said that he is in the schismatical. He did not explain group... a schismatical. The yeah, group of a schismatical, I'm... comma, an unholy imitation of a machine spirit. That's true, but I'm not entirely familiar with what that is. If he can go into more detail, that'd be good to know. It'll be funny uh, if he's just like, I just told you. <laughs> what is a schism or schismatical? Not, well, a little bit more info. Uh, uh, an ugly mockery of a noble machine spirit created by the warp. Sometimes a few lines of despicable scrap code or a small clump of the motive force falls under the arch enemy's influence and degenerates into an abomination of this sort. One whose very existence is an insult to the Omnicide's wisdom. Um... Oh, good heavens. I, sh I sure hope no one here is a programmer. Well, I'd fall under two or three in this case, but I think trying to save him would be better. I shall help that man save is far him. Gone. Perhaps you should have tried to save him before you asked all of your questions, but there's that, there's that. No, because we need to know first. The possessed man responds with a burst of repulsive laughter. Every now and then, a word or two of Gothic finds its way into the binary obscenities pouring out of his vox in what seems to be the schismatic uh, tentative forays into a language that is alien to it. Wait, is he his body swearing convulses. in binary? Yeah. <laughs> uh, his body convulses. His joints twist at unnatural angles with the sound of bursting steel couplings. As the possessed man him. thrashes about, his internal augments emerge gradually through the hanging tatters of his flesh, as though an iron homunculus hidden inside the tech priest were trying to cast off the meat cocoon it no meat longer cocoon. needed. That's <laughs> I, hilarious! We I killed actually. Him. We should have killed him. Like you will that. We should have uh, killed him. Hey, there's still a chance. Um, there's still a chance. 25, 25. Man, my money's on the 25 for real. Uh, I well, I I'm gonna go with the tech use. Yeah. Well, I was gonna. That 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 one makes more sense than just praying that his soul is saved to Cain. Um. So. 
100 percent chance this works. Do uh, it. Anyways, uh, so Pascal's mechanendrite extends a thin drilling needle. Sacred, uh, un. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> what? I Unjuant. don't know that word still. Unjuin, thank you, Ek. Uh, sacred Unjuin glistens on it. A code purification aria is heard as the needle sinks into the possessed tech priest's skull and touches his neural augmentic, uh, forming an electric current within it. Extreme strain is visible on his face. Furious litanies pour out of his vox. Result failure of requesting assistance. Uh, may the machine god heal you. Send a purifying charge of motive force into the possessed man's body. And you uh, get like a magic potion or oil or some sort of alchemical type thing. Thank you. I've never heard of that word before. <laughs> uh, undaunted, you grab one of the several cables and press it into the tech priest's body, and a shock of formidable power shakes the possessed man. Machine oil gushes out of his mouth. His vox hisses deafeningly as the flow of motive force burns the corruption uh, in his sacred iron. The overload destroys some of the circuit boards of his neural uh, augmentics, resetting his code and erasing the schismatical from his existence. The tech priest's eyes roll up, and he loses conscious, crushed yet still alive and no longer in the thrall of corruption. With the utmost care, Pascal takes his body down from the mechanism and lays it on the floor, his stirring litanies of gratitude to the Omnisaya echo through the hall. Rest, tech brother. We will come back for you when uh, uh, when we have done our duty to the miraculous fusion reactor. He will not survive. <laughs> Lord Captain, the Omnisaya commands a pious mind to strive towards uncovering the truth. Therefore, I will not stop until I find my mentor and understand his connection to the servant of the machine god. I request the privilege of joining your retinue as a rightful companion. Can offer to fulfill duties as an engine seer on your ship in exchange for the right to follow you and conduct my own investigation. Item received, comma, comma. <laughs> I don't wow. know what that is about, but hey, look, he's still there. Despite all the suffering he's endured, the tech priest is still alive, though unconscious. See, and you were saying we should kill him. I'm still we saying we should kill him. We just had to remove a virus. <laughs> Pretty much. I'm just, I'm just saying, <laughs> killing him would have been easier. Oh, it 100% would have been. But would it have been right, right, Astro? Yes, you would give him the Emperor's mercy. Honestly, it might have been a mercy to keep or to save him, but. Okay. <laughs> you basically you basically deleted everything he once was. He's alive. Just won't be the same when he wakes up. Uh, no, we only deleted some of his his brain. Yeah. Well, and s s a little bit more than just that, judging by the description. All right, Bella. We're going to have to... Game? There's ignoring my thing because I accidentally clicked on Pascal. <laughs> mm, shit. Oh, oh. That is a broken rib. Oh, no. <laughs> What's a broken rib? Uh, I've got a broken rib. Yeah. I didn't know I was standing in the stupid thing. I was trying to catch up to you guys. Do I need yeah, to follow you guys? Yes. You kinda, yes. Yeah, right. I wasn't sure if we were like zoning out or something. No, we were moving here for me to interact with the circular cogitator once you get here. Yeah, I just don't want you to get shocked on the way here. Too late. <laughs> yeah, you took so much electricity, it somehow broke your rib. <laughs> I don't want to know how much electricity that takes. Enough. <laughs> hey, Hob, come here. Uh, oh. Machine altar accepts. Okay. And yeah. we're going to save before entering there. Because oh, I have a strength feeling. Strength and toughness are both reduced by 20, and action points are reduced by 1. I didn't fix yeah. it. <laughs> Oh. oh, my fellas. Uh. Damn. Okay. Oh. I don't know if these guys are. Oh, no, they look perfectly fine. You can see. Uh, they got snail bags. Attacking us. Yeah, they got snails. Yet, a shortish muscular man wearing the scarlet colors of the priesthood of Mars step into your path. 
The wrinkles on his cheek and forehead point to his pro uh, propensity for frequent outbursts of fierce anger. But right now, he is showing no signs of aggression. Glowing blue patterns of electric tattoos or electus show through his oddly bluish tinted skin. Uh, the man's eye sockets are dark and empty, uh, and or yet he turns his face straight towards you with no hesitation. He has a sharp, screeching voice, unlike, or unlike a bird's cawing, or not unlike. Sorry. So who wants to do this one? Well, can I do, can I do a bird call right now? Hold on. Eh, nope. Man, can't. If only, if only Raven Shit. were here, honestly. <laughs> I got no bird in me right now. I, I okay. can't get my voice over any o o other tone other than this one. I'm talking to Lori and I have broken ribs, so I can't. Okay. May the charge of the Omni Sire's mercy persist in the hands of the faithful. That's the most Zinchian voice I've okay. ever heard. Do you want me to change it? Life? No, it's perfect. See, I can't hit that tone right now. I'm impossible. May the motive force persist in their batteries. Okay. So um, we don't have many resistors on your circuit? Like, what, huh? Nah. Uh, uh, it's ours now, but it's under our protection. I could say I could say it's under our protection. We're dim. It's under our protection. Why did you hover over two for so long? Uh, just where I was hovering my mouse. Uh... Yeah, I like that one. I, rogue trader Kane von Valencius, declare this monastery to be under my protection. Uh, the motive force brought you here at the right time, pilgrim. Pretty sure he's also a cannabis. He, he's a tech priest. Um, the hallowed electrodynamic synobium receives you, pilgrim. I am Da Impulse Six. A servant of the motive force and a praetor electroid of his sacred monastery. Respect. Pascal bows down humbly before the man. A trill of binaric signals come from his vox, to which the praetor responds with a solemn gesture of blessing. Pascal turns to you and says. The rank of Praetor Electroid is a sign of high standing within the Electro- or Electro Priest fraternity. To have been granted an audience is a great honor. Uh, Dar Impulse fa or 6, sorry. Uh, it was you, was it not, that Logus Abel came seeking an interpretation of his data trance. Yes, brother, Abel arrived here to engage in a magnetic meditation that would help clarify his visions. Unfortunately, the heretic machinations prevented us from completing the ritual. The esteemed Logos volunteered his help in defending the monetary, but contact with him was soon lost afterwards. Tell me more about Logos Abel. We did not speak much to each other. He preferred to devote his time to solitary reflections in his chapel. The Omnisire has given Tech Brother Abel a gift of great insight, which allows him to discern each individual facet of existence rather than the overall view. This makes his logic different from that of other people. His mind has always been able to combine facts and conclusions into harmonious wholes that were nothing short of beautiful. Many among my flock found his summons poetic. What kinds of visions was he receiving? The Omnisire's revelations was encrypted with great meticulousness, which indicates its great importance. Grasping it fully is beyond my ability, but a single touch was enough for me to realize the enormity of the secret concealed within. Or, more exactly, the secret design which was how Tech Brother Abel referred to it. His mind had discerned in the world around him traces of some grand silence that he wished to comprehend. I have rescued him from the insurgents. I hope the Omnisire preserves Tech Brother Abel's life, that he may continue to comprehend the mysteries he was tapped into. I have a few questions about this place and the people in it. Truth is, the, or is like light, and blocking its path is criminal. The Praetor Electroid nods majestically. Who are you? The 
hard-working servant and dwellers of the Cenobium Electropiece of the Adeptus Mechanicus. The Corpus Gari did us a great honor by entrusting it into our care in the sacred relic around which the hallowed electrodynamic Cenobium was built. What precisely do you believe in? We have devoted ourselves to the worship of the aspect of the Machine God, which is known as the Motive Force. It is the blessed divine spark that creates impetus in the universe. The Omnisire, in his mercy, gave the world the gift of the Motive Force, and we follow its impulses in order to increase it, bring it to lay people, and protect it from the unholy hands. The relic that the monastery protects provides the entire planet of Rykad Menors with the blessed motive force, and we, unworthy though we are, are glad to serve the ancient machine spirit that dwells in this place. Tell me more Burgess. about your relic. Burgess what was that? Burgess electricity. <laughs> Pretty much. Uh, it would be pointless to describe the miraculous fusion reactor. Only the, uh, through the be or beholding its ferocious power can one comprehend its blessings. Our blessed essence, the fear that, uh, the, and fear the might of the Omnisire. Its core was found 4,000 years ago and delivered to Rakad Menors by the holy warrior of faith, Lock Impulse. A uh, high during one of, uh, or I during one of his campaign, or the first, oh wait, the first, my bad. Lock Impulse the first during one of his campaigns. Its sacred spark has not gone out for an instant, and the walls and power units of the Cenobium have been erected around the relic in order to protect it from the ignorant lay people, as well as protect them from its formidable might. Pascal keeps solemn. I'm gonna need to go grab some more water at this rate. Gosh darn, my voice. Hmm. Pascal keeps his solemn silence, but the quick clicking of his mechanendrite's claw betrays excitement at being so close to the sacred archaeotech. You are not like the other or the other members of the Adeptus Mechanicus I've met. Our faith imposes a duty of obedience on us. Every electro priest is given num er, numerous electus uh, that combine in a blessed voltageist circuit allowing feeble flesh to withstand the might of the motive force. That is why our skin glows with its light, and our eyes boil and melt when we are ordained. The Omnisized Tears is what we call this phenomenon, this dying away of unworthy flesh. As we shun the lay person's primitive means of looking at the world, we gain the ability to sense the motive force around us with our entire bodies. I understand everything. I'm pleased to be a conductor of truth. Why are you calling me a pilgrim? Only those lay people who desire to experience the motor force are allowed to cross this monastery's threshold. All others are profaners and criminals. You do not belong to the fraternity of Electro Priest, but your intentions are good. If you were not seeking the Omnisire's wisdom, then it would or, or then it was the motor force itself that brought you here to find it. Well, what happened here and how did you manage to survive? When the heretics descended in droves upon this Cenobium, we gave battle. But the unholy foes buried the Omnisire's warriors under a mass of their bodies, thus extinguishing the defender sparks of purity. It was then that I ordered my few remaining brethren to retreat into the monastery's secret chamber. Upon taking refuge there, we began to destroy that blasphemous intruder and serep or the blasphemous intruders in serepitous way or serendip serep ser serepit mm. my pronunciation today is terrible serepit ways alas as fiery as my brethren's anger was i had no right to permit them to die in honest combat for the task of taking back our abode still lay ahead of us. Well, Astro, seeing as you're Heinrichs. What a snazzy laugh. Look at his hair. I must commend the skill which your secret chambers are concealed. You hear a tinga of wounded pride in Hendrix's words, as if he upset about failing to discover the electropy's shelter. Your choice of tactics was wise as well. There was no point in losing more lives in the massacre that the cultists wrought. 
center of the heretics fought her way into the Ark, wherein dwells the miraculous fusion reactor. She's trying to desecrate the rites of operation with her un unholy litanies, so that the relic may be corrupted and the world of Rek and Menoris may perish in a fount of fire. But my brethren, in this magnetic meditation, er, or in their magnetic meditation, are hampering her efforts by chanting access request prayers in unison, thereby suppressing the commands that the blasphemous enters. Praetor Electroid nods towards his entranced comrades. This unholy, er, sorry, this holy place will be protected against sacrilegious practices, I swear it. Um... Scoff. <laughs> Um... My enforcers and the governor's guards can help re you reclaim the monastery. Uh... Oh wait, I don't have to put on... I cannot allow this, lay people are forbidden from visiting the monastery, and only so selected few are allowed to behold the Ark and the Ark within. You and your retinue are pilgrims of a special status bestowed by the Emperor. However, should any soldier unblessed by the Omni Sire cross the monastery threshold, I will deem them a heretic and have them put to death. Okay, that's fine. fine. Confirmed. The presence of lay people on monastery grounds without the Praetor's Electroid's blessing will be regarded as sacrilegious violation of the unholy rite of operation. Or of the holy rite of... I'm struggling today. Uh, Heinrichs opens his mouth for a second to say something, but changes his mind and quietly clears his throat instead. Uh... You made the right decision when you chose to avoid combat and save yourselves. Thank you, Pilgrim. It was not easy watching unholy truder stampede through the chambers of my temple. We all envied our brethren who had fallen before that sac or sacrilege began. I wish to get to the ho uh, holy reactor. Okay, it sounds like we have a fight on our hands, fellas. Uh, requires yeah, yeah, dogmatic. Got minus Twenty uh, <laughs> <laughs> strength and toughness. We can run to the ship and back if you want. Nah, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Yeah, the Ark awesome. is hidden from Pilgrim's eyes. But considering the electro- er, Look, Hob's Hob. Hob can fight with broken ribs. Yeah. I'm confident of that. Damn but right. Considering, but considering the extraordinary circumstances of your visit to this monastery, I grant you that right. The hall that leads to the High Reliquary has been barred by the enemy. But I will open a secret path for you. Enter the Ark and experience the motive force, Pilgrim. We shall- Pray, or we will pray to the security system that they may refrain from punishing you for your intrusion. And then I see I can't choose this option Not here. Dogmatic. <laughs> I must press on. May the or may the charge of the Omnisire's grace persist in the batteries of the faithful. What'd you get, Michael? Dude, that doesn't answer. What did we get? Ow, Anything well, good? I just grab and get. You didn't... Well, uh, now I have to look through the weapons to see if there's anything worth No, rent. no weapons. We got... No. Machine rights. And as well as stuff. Machine rights. Yeah. Okay. Then let us forge forward. Guys? Can we talk to any more of them? Oh, oh, maybe not. He has nothing to, new to say... They're all just going to say more of the same thing. Oh, hold up. Hover your mouse over the guy in front of me, and you'll see oh, that yeah. his outline is extending yeah, is. to all the effects. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all of them that are looks nice. goofy. Do all of them? They all do. That's funny. Okay, let us move what do you into mean battle. Magnetic meditation. No! Magnetic meditation. Uh, they understand yeah, Kane's, yeah. yeah. They understand Kane's theory of magnetism. I always keep my options open. 
Perfecto. Oh, look at that uniform walking. Oh, Aurora. <laughs> I still think, forever. I still think Kane looks oddly menacing with the glowing goggles. Fantastic. <laughs> that is the Lord Royalis. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> they have the same face shape as those things from Legend of Zelda. So who wants to do this person? Uh, they. Uh... I see. I see how it is. Uh, the oh, face of the woman. Kind of spoke with that madness. I think they have something similar. I'm not sure. All right. I'll I'll do my best. The face of the woman who stands before you is hidden behind a grotesque barred mask. Yet the voice pouring out beneath it belongs to someone else. Is the husky somber mask? Void wolf. A void wolf. A border of ships. How Wait. Predictable your patterns. Wait. It. <laughs> I, for some reason, I imagine her voice as Dr. Girlfriends from Adventure Bros. Never heard of it in my life. She has a, a male, bassy, chain-smoking, everyday voice. Ah. Uh. Uh, yeah, I mean, let me throw on I custom pitch. I my voices, then. <laughs> it's said that the voice isn't even her. Do you want to do it? I can let you keep it if you want. No, it's fine. Let me see how, how this sounds real quick. Down here. There we go. I just love doing here. That's what I would say if I were here to put this. I put you to be a pathos. So static. All the possible deaths you have started only to perish here in the fiery tempest that will mark the final dawn. <laughs> Subtitles, please. Oh, is it too hard to understand? I could understand what you're saying because I have subtitles, but... It, it, it's pretty hard to understand. It sounds like <laughs> a very a very deep orc voice or something. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can't quite do a Dr. Girlfriend's voice, so I have to use the voice changer. Hold up, let me see how this sounds here. Mm. I'll just have to work with it. Um. You have arrived just in time, little cog. This is Magicals use our Agoria like a mask to subdue the reactor. Is that better, by the way? Yay, nay. Maybe uh, a say. little, a little bit. Uh, maybe don't try to make your voice deep. Let it do the deep part for you. Um. In that case. Let me see, hold up. Let me go back to custom pitch and drop that a bit more and see how this sounds. That'll have to do. Um, anyways, uh, I have to switch to Pascal's. Um, Pascal's Vox rests musingly. Um, a cog. I cannot comprehend why apostates try to insult me by comparing me to the sacred symbol of our fate. It is irrational. His visor lights up like a crimson herald of bloodshed, and his drilling mechanendrites whir viciously as if or as it readies to strike. The sacred cog grinds all corruption to dust. From the dust I will build order. Um What a talented enemy! Can you do the governor's voice? <laughs> That's the most. <laughs> That's funny. Silence, heretic. Your crazed preaching will not touch my mind. Uh, hit the pitch. I just saw the Z symbol. <laughs> Do you cling to your blindness so desperately? Do you think it will protect you from the blinding radiance of the truth? Is that better, by the way? You sound like... Huh? You sound like if a Brecken from Lethal Company had a voice. I don't know how to explain that. Is it better? Uh, yay or nay? Know. I don't know. <laughs> 
what, what I will course? continue with it until unless somebody says something else. Then uh, oh, the woman's question. voice breaks and shifts to a different pitch and timber. A martyr's voice, young, fervent, and in pain. Okay, so it's not the same deep voice. Somebody want to do this one? Time has all but run out. I can hear the mist of the future knocking on the door of the present. Choose quickly what you want to be when it walks in. A blind slave to what is gone. A faithful servant of what is to come. Or a corpse. I would take some time to wrestle uh, for you the details of the future. That the cult prophesies. Hopefully, when we're done, what's left of you will be still be capable of Korean speech. Whoo! Your people on my head. Oh. Why? As a twilight, Nemtius Conrad marked you as a target. Your foiling of his plan sealed your death warrant. It is now a predestined certainty that changes can no longer affect. Who are you? My name is known to you. I am Aurora, servant of Yurlon the Cruel, and the spark of the final dawn that is destined to set Rykid Menoris ablaze. A great path for one who has born into the Imperium's bondage, but shunned her predestination in favor of the changes promised by the Edge of Daybreak. Ah, uh, the villain can't help but tell their whole thing, huh? Whose I servant are you? This. Is Orlon a demon or just another heretic? Resounding laughter comes from behind the mask. Your fancy is so amusing. Why, you have no inkling of the chasm that separates us. He is a prophet who foresaw our impending doom, and who graciously bestowed upon us the right to choose a different path. He is a shard of ancient wisdom from a time before we were slaves to our bitter predestination. Making her more emotional than she probably should be. The sure. Edge of Daybreak. Is that your unholy patron? Also, sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off there. What Continue you're what you're saying. I mean, when they talk about the change is coming of course they'll be emotional like yeah. this is it <laughs> i think i think i think it fit the end of day or the edge of daybreak is that your unholy patron our teacher our savior our merciful god born in the immaterium out of the woes of those laboring under a legacy of ignorance and servitude this is why i follow Z you cannot <laughs> see the woman's face behind her mask but judging by her tone of malicious triumph you could swear she is smiling. And he remembers you, Cain von Valencius. The silly savior fantasy you have been acting out amuses the true masters of those people's faiths. So what is this final dawn? Uh, it is all your followers ever talk about. Is this still her voice? Okay. Salvation from a death whose name is yet unknown, but whose approach is sensed by many. Soon it will claim every inhabitant of the Corona's expanse. Do you think anyone will come to our aid when cataclysms shake our homes and planet-wide genocides are unleashed? Will the Emperor help? Or the idol of iron they call the Omnissiah? No. We will die alone and abandoned. Only one deity is promising salvation. The Edge of Daybreak, mercy, and salvation will come to all who believe in him and purify their souls in the light of the final dawn. What servitude are you talking about? What predestination? Everyone born in the Imperium has a predestination. The soldier, the commoner, the administratum official, the technomath, the void rat. All are uh, consigned to serving the Golden Throne and then dying a grim death for its glory. The Imperium never thinks twice about treating people as exploitable and expendable. After all, they are the most easily replenished of all resources. Even your path is predestined, rogue traitor. You will inevitably perish on your quest to expand humanity's domain, and your end will be particularly grim and ghastly. The fruits of your efforts will be enjoyed by others, the eternal aristocrat to dwell on Mars, Terra, and other safe worlds. They insist that it is the natural order of things, but that is a lie. It is an order that benefits them. Why are you blinding people? Do you think they are blind? They see far more than you do. Through reflections and mirrors blessed by the energies of the Immaterium, the Edge of Daybreak reveals them visions of true existence and gives them glimpses of what is to come. 
The eyes lie. Our erstwhile masters have taught them to see only what is consistent with the lies they tell. The gift we give is that of true sight. I know what they've been doing to these people. That magnifying glass was showing them into the warp. Womp womp. Well. Oh my god, no matter why they're mad. The woman takes a glass prism out of the folds of her clothes and looks at you th uh, through it with a mocking chuckle. The prism's bluish pink sheen imprints itself on your retinas as though it has been burned into them. Guess what I see when I look at you? I think that is an. I think that is enough heretical talk. Are you. Uh. Oh, wait. Sorry. Go on, Kaylee. Conversations about truth always frighten ignorant minds. Are you trying to blow up the reactor? <laughs> That's such a topic change. <laughs> I'm lighting the spark of the final dawn. Sometimes the future revealed in the edge of daybreak's visions is fragmented between the facets of possibility and the views unclear. I have glimpsed the importance of this place for what is to come, and I have solved the puzzle. The flash of purity will transform this world and bring it closer to the immaterium in which it will be reborn. False believers will perish in the fire, whilst the faithful will find their salvation and their new form in it. Okay. Oh. It's oh, him. I don't have it on. Hold up. There we go. You will never tame the spirit of this ancient and noble machine, ignorant layperson. It does have a vile temper, but I have assistants who can help tame it. The woman nods casually towards the maimed electro priest whose hands are affixed to the control panels with steel stakes. Damn. Oh! I didn't even see him there. Uh, one of the servants of the Omnisai cast a tortured glance at you, his voice trembling with horror. Uh, who wants to do this one? Guess it's me. Blasphemous spirits have crawled under our skin and into our sacred iron. Take the motive force of our bodies, I implore you. We do not wish to offend the Omnisire with the sacrilege our hands are committing. They resisted for a long time, but now their bodies and souls belong to the schismaticals. Line after line, the scrap code they produce will awaken the reactors and yielding spirit as well. And it, too, will yearn for change and freedom. Enough. I will rid my Rykad Minoris of your tyranny. Boo. No! Boo. Screw Boo. you all! Boo. Screw you listen, all! Listen, listen. All I'm saying is, is, is what are you Ride doing here? She's right! Right, huh? you're lame. Boo! Uh oh, it's, equi it's equivalent exchange. Go on. <laughs> Boo! Oh, guys, she's right! She's <laughs> right, but going about it the wrong way here. Arguably, <laughs> yes. Arguably, yes. The woman's voice becomes thin and brittle like that of an innocent child. Execute them. <laughs> In the name of the edge of daybreak. That's not an innocent you, child. She, That's a demon. Uh, what? Also, I am also, an innocent child. <laughs> also, Kaylee, you can't say maybe. Her plan is to literally exterminate a whole world. Yeah. And the Imperium has done better? Via, ex like... via exploding a fucking arc reactor, I'm guessing, from this mechanical shit. Oh, okay, let me, let me put it this way, Kaylee. Let's say that there's... Or let's say racist. They're all bad people, right? My solution is to kill every single racist, period, instead of convincing them that they are wrong. Would I be in the right for doing that? I would argue. I'm sorry, that. repeat that? Racist. All horrible people, right? I decide that because they're bad people, I will kill every single one of them rather than convince them that their ways are wrong. Does that make me a good person or did I do something wrong to bad people? Uh, morally neutral? I'd the argue. Way I see it, the way I see it, they may have said things, however, they are terrorists, and that's that. You're oh yeah, we don't negotiate with terrorists. Exactly. That's oh, all I need. That's, <laughs> that's all that anyway. needs to be said. You're a terrorist. Yeah. yeah, she's a terrorist. So, um, 
The Electro Priests rip their hands off the command panels, rending their flesh on the stakes that pierced them. As their schismatical, uh, schismatical controlled bodies are imbued with the motive force's radiance, all the unfortunate can do is scream in horror and plead for a swift death. Roar begins muttering in unholy litany and broken gothic. Get him! They failed to take me out with their blasphemous words. You cannot make out her blasphemous words, but the name the heretic keeps repeating, the itch of daybreak, digs into your hearing like a blade into defenseless flesh. Its sound, er, its sound is almost physically painful. It spawns strange and impossible phantoms in your mind. That was a success? What was a failure? Uh, you, had a six, a, you had a 65% chance. Yeah, I think I did fail when I did this. Honestly, oh, I think wait, for my 25% willpower, my 25, I managed to um, pass it. However, you managed to muster your strength and banish it from your mind. Yeah, the solution to, to, to dealing with bad people isn't to murder every Get one of them. Out of you. Show them no mercy. Why not? Oh, wait. Where am I? Listen, listen, I'm not about to show code. I'm gonna go stab her, bro. <laughs> go stab her. Can you? Wait, no shit. You can't hit her right now. Yeah. Fuck. Um. I'm She's going smart. to. Where am I in this whole ordeal? I am very far up uh, in the list. I'll be right here. I am going to take cover. I'm gonna take cover behind this for now. I should be safe oh. behind that. Why well, fail? Henrik ain't up. Did I hear that right, boss? You don't want me to kill them all? Oh, I want you to kill every one of them. They're all heretics. Okay. Okay. Yep. I, the only one my... here to Hob. You're terrorists. Let yeah. Let me help you, Hob, on this side of things. My, 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 spe my speech. My speech was was about not killing every single person just because they believe something different. Now, if they're trying to actively cause problems and be bad people, then yes, then you exterminate them. Yeah. Hmm. Quizzer, are you hearing this blasphemy? <laughs> oh shoot, we have two rounds until the reactor goes boom. Yeah, I don't know. It'll be alright. You know what? I'm sick right here, just in case I can go I just I can stop him. Yeah. How do we stop the reactor from going boom? Uh, Listen, she's got a big shield on him, I'm not sure. I know. Yeah. I'm just gonna kill stick right here. Just in kill case. the electro priest first. What yeah, electro priest? Kill the Electro Priest right. first. Oh. That is our that is our order here. We are taking out the Electro Priest. There is one right here for you. There's one here. Oh, I see. Electro. And there's one here. Get rid of them first. They're powering the machine. First things first. Uh, Hob, where are you? Let's make some opportunities. Also, this game allows me to. Also, this game allows me to play the the not dogmatic character. So I'm playing the non dogmatic character. Nah, you you miss out saying for the emperor. I don't want to hear it. You're lame. Never mind. The electro priest needs to go. He needs to be the main target. Yeah, alright. Yeah, let me try this. It's as good as done. The Electro Priest absolutely has to go. I'm pretty I'll sure it'll explode with otherwise. Which one? There are several. All of them. <laughs> They've been undoubtedly corrupted. This is the only way I can see to prevent the reactor from exploding. I don't know how many we have to take out, but I'm assuming killing one will give us more time. Let's see, can I be an absolute- yes I can! Okay, I think there's four electro piece. There is four. Don't have line of sight on any tech priest for the default. I'll do my best. But I can read on this Astro, I'm gonna need you to join me in taking out this Electro Priest. That was the plan. Good. <laughs> we, we can't let this reactor explode. Of course not. Wanna know why? We're here. We explode, we dead. <laughs> 
up, Hob. Hob got that parry. Got that parry, baby. Uh, it's Victor's turn. Cool. Do you have a line of sight on that priest? Which one? Uh, this one here. What? Yes, I do. Watch this. Consider oh! The oh! The nice. <laughs> oh, snake, you're a little far. I can't hit you right now. I'll be fine. Get, get Henrik's foot somewhere. Yeah. Uh, not much, but it works. Yeah, it's healing. Now, hypothetically, with my damage carryover, if I shock those weak guys, it should affect that priest, too. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, hey, Astro, change of plan. Since that one's nearly dead, focus on the one on the right. One and on I should right, be able to finish. What are you yeah. referring to? The the one on the right of you here by by Hob and one way by in the Prometheus. Back. Oh, oh, that's no, right. the one okay. with Hob and Prometheus. I should be able to finish this one off. And if Kaylee's hitting shots like that, uh, I'll push up to the other Electro Priest, and we should be able to take it out. I have an idea for this one. Okay. <clears throat> hey, y'all be alright. Second abilities, go! Grenade! <laughs> <laughs> My favorite psyker already. My favorite psychic ability. Throw grenade! But the thing is, I ain't even done for real. Hey hop. <laughs> Muscle. Mm. Rarg. Ooh, what's that? <laughs> Bust your strength, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, plus nice. ten. Very cool. But the thing is, I ain't done either. For the Emperor. <laughs> now, go stupid. Charge from back here. I don't know that I can. You might have to step out and then charge. Okay, I can charge there. Now, let's see. Can I get him to attack me? Do one, two, three, six, maybe. I'm not gonna get fancy with this. I think I'm just gonna smack him. Yeah. Sounds good. All right. Mm -hmm. Don't hit the space bar. Almost did that. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been a mistake. At all costs. So, uh, go next single shot or something. This is going to be challenging. We might have just enough time to stop them. But we might have to take some damage in order to prevent the reactor from going off. It'll be alright. That's worth it, in my eyes. Excess. The God Emperor protects. Let's take him out. Yeah, this will take care of this guy. Uh, let's see. Charm. I will say there's another priest there that we're going to want to take out soon. There's more! Hold up, there's six Electro Priests. Don't worry, the number round go up every time we kill. Okay, good. So there's one back here. Nothing of value has been lost. Can you? Okay, let's see here. Oh, is that action? If I move, that's fine. If I move here, and I switch to this. And I shock him here. Oh, wait, he won't take shock damage. I can't do that. Um, do I take out the minions on the path? 
Let me see if the oh. damage will carry over from them, because it's supposed to carry over, but I don't know if it can hurt him. Go on. Y yeah, that's what I gotta do. It did! Yes! It worked how I thought it would! And I got an yeah, achievement man. for that. <laughs> so did I. <laughs> I got a heroic action, too, when I could... Tr no, shocking. I, there's nobody in range that I could shock. Wait, I could take out the guys near you all as well with a heroic action, and it would lower veil degradation. Yeah, that's what I think I'm gonna do. Oh wait, never mind. He's literally th three blocks out of range. My bad. I misjudged. The red lines were on the red carpet, and I got confused. So, uh, instead, I will, because I'm leading the left side here, I'm going to put this on me here. I'm going to do that as well, and that'll be my turn. Woo! He doesn't seem Damn. to care about his guys. <laughs> well, he's, they don't want to be doing this, and they're oh, aware, so. Ah. Oh. Oh, good heaven! Oh, what were the dodge at? Snake, thing? I thought you said you didn't need healing! I didn't, at the time. <laughs> oh, Do you need asshole. healing now? I, I'm trying to figure out where my fucking dodge is. It ain't I mean, happening. at that point, you didn't really need dodge. You just got that gunner in front of you. You just needed a shield. Uh, I think, uh, yeah, later you at might... some point, I would like to respectfully just give heavy armor. Okay, to fucking that's fine. Uh, you, you you're gonna like need to... Joy. Kaylee, slight change of plan for now. We need we need at least somebody somebody to go and heal Michael. I will be sending Comrade Victor over in that direction. No, the thing is, I got it. Y'all guys handle over there. Don't worry, Captain. I won't stand for it. I don't think you're in cover right now. Yeah, you're not in cover. Which is part of the reason you got so lit up. I'll see to it personally. In trench? There's no trench. Where is the trench? Okay. You could also have right, like, Pascal heal him with the, no, the like big medkit. No, like I that side, I got it. Uh, see, I would love to to give him the juice. Unfortunately, he's, he's one out of range. range. Ah, okay, that's fair. Yeah, Handle that side, I got snake. As long as the, these guys don't all hit me, Hendrix has me. Okay. Okay, well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna heals? trust you. In that case... I did medical training and all that jazz. Oh, okay. All right. In that case, can you move Pascal up to try attacking this priest? Oh, all the way over there? I don't think I can reach him, but I can sure you start moving over there. That's what I'm talking about. Start moving over there. I was gonna don't say you might want to be in cover, but... Well, you have 46 health. Intimidation. That's fun because the last upgrade I got to also angered me. Oh. It's not letting me do what I really want to do. No! Kaylee, I did give Pascal a different weapon. He now has a plasma pistol. Yeah, I've noticed that. Uh. <laughs> Welcome to the plasma gang. Uh. The, I want to go the back. You want to what? I want to go back. Oh. What, to the bolt gun? Ow. I can't catch my breath. Okay. Yeah, Snake, I think you want to invest in getting in cover next next time it's your turn. <laughs> There's no way I can shoot that absolutely I'm realizing shot I want to shoot you the most, because you're like the easiest target now. Yeah. No shot. Okay, I can hit any of the Electro Priests pretty much. Any of the two in the back, actually. Uh, the if you want to take those shots, it's up to you. Far right. Far right. Okay. Yeah, far right has enemies behind them. It'd be good to hit that. Gotcha. Nice. I was hoping for over penetration, but happens. It's a mess. They don't have pen. <clears throat> I've seen. I thought las guns have shot Bloop. through people. Uh, I'm gonna use a heroic act next round in order. Or. No, I won't be able to. Well, I might be able to get the cultist gunners. Um, 
That way I can lower veil degradation because we're about to go already over. <laughs> apparently healing takes a lot of veil stuff, so... It apparently does. Alright, for starters... Learn cover. Number you two. might want to invest in the, the the perk that reduces veil degradation for uh, psychic power at the start of each turn of your turns by two. Woo! Ryan. What? I might be stealing your daring breach. We have a lot of veil degradation. I'll leave that decision up to you, but I do think it'd be good to lower that, but up to you. As a person that's technically a psyker, that don't use all my psyker abilities, it affects me least. But if you go want ahead. it, you can have no, it. Go ahead, and, oh. go ahead and use it. Just get some kills with it. I always get kills. As many as you can get, so that way we get more stuff, because I'm going to need that veil stuff real soon here. We're going to have to lower the amount of Veil here in this particular case. Perfect. Nothing stands against me. I am satisfied with that. Good choice, Good Astro. <laughs> I'm fully satisfied with your decision. Yes, the sir. one thing I know about doing in this game, it's numbers. Especially when it's damage. Let's see. I, I don't. Sure. But I need I need kills to go off because our veil degradation's just <laughs> We're one point yeah. away. As long as we're mindful with our warp, we should be alright. You gonna charge the uh, priest deck? Yeah. I'm just looking at my other abilities real quick. Mm -hmm. Um. Opposing me was your biggest mistake. Yeah, that's every child moment. <laughs> cool. We have four uh, turns. Uh, I'll have to move up to... Are we supposed to be doing anything to shielded girl, or does that shield mean she can't be touched? She uh, can't she be touched until be touched. the electro piece is dead. Okay. See those, you see those guy with the snail backs? We gotta kill them. Alright, just making sure. Uh, so... I almost got enough to get you your veil degradation. Hopefully <laughs> this doesn't kill me in the or doesn't well i'm not gonna get killed and i've already taken damage there's no reason for me to play it super safe so let's go ahead and and let's go ahead and take a shot damn it um i'm going to forego using a psychic power for now the veil degradation still increased anyways. See, we'll be alright. Worst thing that can happen is a demon spawns. Just kidding, that, that totally don't happen in this game. I wonder if yeah. it does happen. Alright, um, you don't know. That'd be funny. So then I'm gonna move up. I'm gonna trust Kaylee. I'm gonna trust you to uh to take out the tech pre or the tech the electro priest that's near me. And I'll shock these guys and focus on moving up to the last priest. I surely won't miss and accidentally shoot you instead. I have faith in you. You know what? There's enough zapping no, already. No, this is good as done. Damn it. <laughs> Nate, please! You're really getting upset tandem vibes right now. I mean, come on! <laughs> All this magnetic Down. interference messing with your plasma rifle, man. That's it's probably a, what's going on. It's a tech priest rifle, so I'm just saying it, it, it's the charges in the air that's fucking with it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You can charge a gun early. 
Did you not pray to the machine spirits, Snake? He did not, apparently. Uh, your plasma your, vessel exploded. <laughs> yeah. Oh, good heavens. Listen, did you no. use the overcharged attack? Yeah, I did. Oh. Yeah, that gives it a chance to explode on you. You still have uh. a plasma pistol? Or is it gone? It's still there. Okay. It just it just overheated and blew plasma on its user instead. I see. <laughs> so that's good More. to know that that's how that works. Oh my god, there's blood dripping down the uh, pipes. Oh yeah. Ew. <laughs> okay. Alright, so... I could, uh, probably, I could finish off the Electro Priest back right if you want me to. Yeah, take a shot at him. If you do that, I'll just come back around and get ready to be No! Behind. Victor! Victor! <laughs> happens. Damn. Now all I'm saying is, guys, I know the veil degradation is bad, but... How can you <laughs> Victor's a psyker! So <laughs> Who do you think's been healing you? <laughs> Who do you think's been getting the veil up on what the do side? You, what do you want to do? Heal Kane. Uh, you want to what? Heal Kane. Uh... Or better yet, Hob. Or Prometheus. Uh, no. Hob Prometheus. We'll be alright. I don't um, think. I don't think. He'll, he'll, don't worry, the only don't issue here, please. <laughs> but yeah, I think the only problem that might happen here is they see Prometheus as a standout target. I, I got. He should be. Up. I got five temporary hit points every round, and and uh, I'm reduced every bit of damage that comes my way by five. You don't have to worry about him. He's fine. Right. Ah! <laughs> Summons demon. Nah, uh, I what, should be able to reduce crystal? it next time. <laughs> Was it my turfer? All right, I know what I must do. I'll be back. All right, for starters, you, my man, be erased. Whoa! Oh, you do not lucky I can't closer. Credit. You lucky I can't get closer. If I could have got closer, if I could have got closer. <laughs> You know what, guys? Are we just uh, using the? Uh, we just not. Well, since because we're using it anyways. I'm done with this one. Let's do it. Kill them. The... Kill them all. I can't reach him. He's too far. Do we give? Uh, but I have a gun. Fuck. Uh, he already <laughs> used it. I thought. Oh, did he? Yeah. 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 I used all my range to get over here. Don't worry. At least he will attack me over you, Prometheus, hopefully. Um, I feel like me heading back there, too, is just kind of overkill. And yeah, go gonna be yeah, yeah, go ahead and Yeah, go ahead and start moving towards uh, our side here. Yo, the wall's got eyes. That's fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> And this is why. Yeah. Why are I you should screaming clear, at no one right I there? Should, I should clear. I should clear out some, anyways. Um. What stinks is I only have three action points. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh. So if I move. Hold up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, how far can I strike with this? Um, if I move up, it should reach. Should is the key word. It is. Cool. I'll be able to reduce our veil degradation. There we go. 37 damage up. to each one of those poor bastards. 
<laughs> Alright, it went back up. I, I, I saw that, which means that for whatever reason, it would have gone up to fucking 20. <laughs> well, I'm happy I'm over here, and you're over there. Unless, well then, uh... uh if I can't summon demon, the demon spot is random. <laughs> Um, so that didn't work how I wanted it to. Um, and now I don't have a line of sight on anything except for that, pr or that Electro Priest over there. Yes. So I'll go ahead and... He's out of range for that, but Sad. let's go ahead and see if I hit the shot. I do not. I do not. Um, in that case... I can't examine anybody, but all the... Well, I can examine this guy. There. What are you gonna do, huh? <laughs> Why did you do that? You too! You Why? too! Why did you, you do that? <laughs> they... They panicked. They heard that shot, and they ran. <laughs> okay. So, I don't know why the veil degradation went up and went down at the same time, but... Who the heck knows? Uh, regardless, it's back down to just being 15, which is okay. Yeah, I'll turn to him. As long as you're not healing anybody, it should be okay. I could do. Get him. That's a lie. Dodge. Because we don't need any more. Did did uh, me killing those five enemies in one turn give everybody the achievement? Yep. I think so, yeah. Cool. Get out. Oh, Let me check. I don't think I got an achievement. Good. You may have already had it. It was basically not killed five guys in one in one, in shot. one attack. Yeah. It, just, it didn't pop up for me. I have it. Wait, what happened to the tech priest over or the electro priest here? Probably okay. died. How? Who killed him? When did he die? We got two left. Yeah, we got two left. I just don't know why that one died. I don't remember when that one died. Not attack. Mm. We had nobody. Yeah. Did did I'm wondering if the because I do extra damage to nearby enemies if the attack carries over, I'm wondering. No, 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 if all no, no, you shocked the guy. We told you shocked all the people that you killed them. Yeah. Ah. I see. They took not damage. I've done that twice. Uh, oh damn. Which one? I can kill either. Yeah. Uh, uh, one seventy nine, other seventy nine. Uh, take the one on the left. Take because... the one on the left. Yeah. Yeah. That's just gonna say right. Nice. I love the sheer range I have. It makes me You're so happy using inside. A sniper. I know. It makes me happy. Um. Kaylee, I have something else feeling. to give you. What's up? I'm giving you my metronome next round. If you don't move, uh, you get 10 plus to all characteristics. Oh, oh. sick. I have a, uh, I have something that will stack on that, because, uh, yeah, I have, I have an ability for that, yeah. actually. I've got an ability to this. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna yeah. be using any of my psychic right, powers. Right, the wall's got teeth. That's okay. That's standard each behavior. Don't worry about it. Surely you should know that, Inquisitor. Unless you haven't been reading up on your chaos. He's a Xeno, for one. He doesn't need to focus no! on it. Oh, we get it. <laughs> okay. Enough. <laughs> now an age-rattling voice speaks to you from behind a blood-stained mask. You are powerless to halt the approach of what is to come. I see a crimson trail leading humanity to its doom. I see the glow of the final dawn and the means of existence has made its choice. A dagger flashes in Ara's hand as she drives into the control panel with all her strength. Now you will see it too. This sore loser. A blinding voltaic arc bursts forth from the broken control panel and strikes at Aurora's uncanny mask. Its metal heats up. Smoke billows through the balls. Bro ball! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah? Yeah, man? <laughs> oh, you gonna look through your eye or what? <laughs> you gonna keep speaking, Ryan? <laughs> Is that a problem, Ryan? <laughs> <laughs> you going, Ryan? I'm sorry. 
What was the issue, Ryan? I misspoke. What? No, I didn't hear anything. That was the poor recovery. Ryan. That was the best part. Yeah, like Ryan, did you? Something happened? I couldn't hear. You want to speak? Want to repeat that? Yes. Yeah, this is yeah. what game clipping yeah. is for. Yes. Smoke billows through the bars. <laughs> With a howl, the cultist collapses. <laughs> <laughs> Why? It's gone? Was that it? The final dawn? Why was it so different from what our teacher promised? Laura shakes her head blindly. Her voice is now the voice of a normal middle aged woman, frightened and in pain. What's my, what's my middle aged woman voice? Alright. <clears throat> you will pay for this. You will. You. And the woman boy body goes limp and collapses on the floor. Her iron mask hit the ground with a dull dud. Congratulations, you shocked yourself. <laughs> okay. Uh, Pascal examines the corpse with contempt, then concludes dryly. Confirming purgation uh, and termination. Henrik grimaced in disgust. The heretic took her secrets with her. Hitty. I. Gosh My darn! To I think that was... have changed. I think that was the worst mess up on a word I've ever had. Henrik approaches God. the aura's body and leans over it. A minute, please, Kane. I need no more than a minute. Uh. Inspect the control panel damaged by Aurora. Uh, the cogitator is probably well beyond repair, but your attention is drawn away from the sacred machine and towards the dagger sticking out of the control panel. On closer inspection, it turns out to be a lavishly decorated handguard of a sword whose blade has been pried out. Its pommel is decorated with a strange adornment resembling an eye co uh, covered by a scaled lid. Uh, what remains of the blade has a blue sheen to it, the same tint as Conrad's weapon during the mutiny on your void ship. That is no human-made uh, object. I can't read today. I've messed up my speech so many times. It was grown from wraith bone, a material favored by the Eldari. Huh? Uh... I want to take it. <laughs> take it? You're the rogue trader. <clears throat> oh, wait, but it's only a shard. It's not a freaking... Don't we already sword. have a weapon shard? I threw that away because that was tied to demons. Well, so is this. You want to take another one? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. I realized that. I realized that afterward. Wait, why does an Eldar weapon t attach to demon? I don't understand this one. Okay. Uh, as you lean over the shard, you suddenly hear a multitude of voices. They blend together, and individual words are distorted. Um, ah, I see. As though they are marking your attempts to grasp their meaning. My pronouncing today and words. An ability to read is not existent. Yeah, not okay? today. <laughs> the nagging whisper is like the burning red scratch of an unholy claw upon your mind. Um. Hmm. Both are good choices. Uh, I think I'm gonna go with the dogmatic one on this one. Heinrichs, mm -hmm. take a look over here. Is this by any chance what you are looking for? Uh, Eric raises his head and gets up and makes a wary face as he continues to examine Aura's weapon. It's an unholy object. It's the work of an inhuman hands. And judging by the code I am sensing, it's the tool of the arch enemy. I am most grateful for your vigilance, Kane. Henry takes the strange shard out of the control panel and studies it for a few seconds. Curious. Henry stows the corrupt object away and turns to you. I should have just thrown it off the edge. Gosh darn it. <laughs> Rule creator, on behalf of the Holy Orderus, I thank you for your cooperation and release you from requisition. From this moment on, I am at your service. I am ready to come aboard your ship and head to it for football as soon as you deem it's possible. That is, if you do not have any other business in this system, in which, in case, I'm prepared to sit you in the prompt resolution. I, I need to speak to this man when I do a heretic run. I, I want to see what I happens. Talk to me, you heretic. Okay. 
Um, now, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm nervous. I'm nervous about removing her mask. No, Don't be a terrified. Do it. Do it. Do it. Yeah. Do it. You know what? Do Fine. It. Do it, coward. The iron helmet is attached. There is for. I missed a word now. Gosh darn my reading today. The iron helmet is firmly attached to the heretic's flesh. Uh, her face is impossible to make out in the darkness behind the bars of the mask. But after peering at it a little longer than necessary, you wonder if for a moment you saw something more. I don't move. like what I saw. Move. Let us, something let us finish cleansing the mo uh, monastery, Pascal. Executing. Let the Omnisium given motive force flow and all obstacles in its path be eradicated. Steps on body. <laughs> yep. <laughs> That's a Pascal move. That is. Just standing on her corpse. Tech Breezer, you're just gonna stand in front of me just like that. <laughs> what are you looking at? <laughs> What's that say? Hey. Miraculous fusion reaction. Somebody just punched somebody else. Yeah, I saw. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, I, just, I didn't punch anybody. I just said people on fire like this. You'll regret this. Hey, Ek, I think I have something you might like. Oh. There's Avengers Gauntlets. All attacks of opportunity deal an additional plus agility bonus damage. Oh, nice. So anytime an enemy runs past you, you'll get extra damage. Uh, we got a bless from this prism belong to that leader if you look through it long enough your vision begins to deceive your mind showing what could be instead of what is interesting she mistook that as what was already then who else is going to be up in melee does anybody mind if hob has that i'm not going to be up in melee but i am going to be out in the open your other i don't think you want to be open mr dodge the... man see i need to change <laughs> Or you can be in cover. Both works. <laughs> Pascal, my favorite yeah. melee nerd. I, also, I if like somebody... Is somebody here heretical? E in character? Uh, no. We, okay, so then nobody can use the gem of dark vitality. Probably not. What to do? Uh, you Requires conviction get heretical? Plus four wounds, and when veil degradation is above fifteen, uh, plus ten toughness. Which That's nice. with the amount of well, yeah, with the amount of psychers we have casting spells, we hit kind of often. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna need a new set of gloves at some point. Uh, did we loot everything? I didn't it looks loot like anything. It. That's fine. Everybody else seems to have cleaned up around here. So, I will talk to Pascal if I can. Oh, wait, no. Pascal's... There's more stuff back here in the back. Is there? Hmm. I think so. I got three no. uh, armored body gloves and three... Oh. Oh, are the cultists not lighting up with loot? I don't know why those didn't light up with loot. I'm checking out... I'm checking the gunners. Or I'm double-checking oh, the gunners. Oh, go around the back. Nice. Uh, it's... Have you yep, checked all of the left? There's nothing... Or all the right? There's nothing else on the left. Yep. Right looks good. Okay. Left is good, too, then. Um... Well, then. Are we ready to leave this place? Uh... Unless there's a secret door somewhere? Yeah, I think so. Mmm... I ran around the place and didn't get any observation things to point them out. So, yeah, I think we're good. Let's move on. Oh, over here. Yeah. Oh, there's something there, though. What's in there? Uh, exciting, but not exciting for now. Exciting for later. <laughs> Okay, let's uh -oh. talk to hey. Mister. All right, Hop, go solo. <laughs> oh yeah, there, I'm on it. Yeah, Hop. <laughs> Hop, prepare, prepare to take them all. Grenade on the left and Hob on the right. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> that works. Okay, it seems that we're done here. Why did they all turn and sink? That was horrifying. The machine spirit says to do so. What?
Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, Kaylee, if the healing's too expensive, you might want to invest in the one that uh, reduces veil degradation uh, of major attacks by two. Yeah, I might. Also, I've been randomly... I have been uh, spontaneously inspired to do a heretic run, so I do want to start that very soon. Keep your wits okay. about you. No particular reason. It is time for us to head to the void ship here. I do think we should go see if the governor... I think we can just go to the governor at this point. Oh. I was, gonna use, I was just gonna use this and travel to the governor. I didn't realize there's a path there. Can we heal my wound while we're up oh, on the ship? Oh, once you back at the oh, yeah. 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 does it. Yeah. Nice, nice. Yeah. Exactly so, you have. You no longer have a broken rib. Yeah, <laughs> no longer have a broken rib. That's good. Now I can start doing some real damage. Now, so I did notice there is... I did notice there is a penalty to respecting a character. It costs a day. So if we start... Once we get past this kind of tutorial section... And we start getting into time sensitive things, respect mm. is not enough. I see. Well, I don't need to respect now. I studied it. Now, oh, awesome. Yeah. I, I know exactly what I'm doing with my character. Not really, but it works. Oh. Hey, that's me. <laughs> Rogue Trader. I was somewhat trusted at our first meeting, and I would like to make up for it by expressing my thanks for your assistance hey. in the electrodynamic Synobium. <laughs> Your arrival yeah. could not have come at a better time. He sounds so friendly and inviting! Thanks to you, I have succeeded in finding the object that brought me to this system in the first place. Now that the weapon of corruption has been seized from the cult, I can satisfy the Lord Inquisitor's wish and travel with you to Footfall, once you have finished your business on Rykat. There is one more thing. The Lord Inquisitor gave me this item some time ago. He must have thought it likely that I would find myself aboard this vessel sooner than he. I was instructed to deliver this device to Lady Theodora. However, given recent events, I believe I ought to present it to you. This is an elucidator, a sacred machine capable of translating the languages of remote and lost worlds into low Gothic. It can even process Xenos languages to a certain degree. Not without infelicities, but possibly well. <laughs> I like the be honest, Von Kallax. Is this a tracking device? <laughs> <laughs> well, asking him wouldn't be a good point to ask, so I'll just... You I'll can't just... inquire an Inquisitor? Yeah, that, that, seems like a, that seems like a bad idea. Thank you. The Inquisition's generosity is greatly appreciated. May the Elucidator serve House Von Valancius as faithfully as it has served the acolytes of the Holy Ordos up to now. Ordos. What do you plan to do now? I would like to offer my assistance in resolving your immediate problems. I am aware that the ship suffered considerable losses during the recent mutiny and was damaged by the cultists' actions, and you have lost many valuable officers as well. You are in a difficult situation. I am at your disposal. What do you think will become of the electrodynamic Cenobium? It all depends on the electro priests who survived the attack. Fortunately for them, the cultists did not manage to seriously corrupt the holy site, partly thanks to the priesthood's efforts. Nevertheless, I would not be surprised if the local explorator fleet decides to audit and purge the damaged units once it hears about what has happened. I must return to my duties. Did we leave Henry's... that unconscious tech priest down? <laughs> yes, <laughs> fine. Yes, we like did. Way back. You, you, you mean you mean the one that we partially lobotomized? Yeah. By frying his brain augments. Look, I'm sure some tech brother went up to his entry and found him. <laughs> um, Heinrichs is about to say something else when he is interrupted by the sound of a vox signal. Someone is trying to contact you. Thank you for your time. Please consider me at your complete disposal while I am aboard your vessel. Say my name. <laughs> I'm what? joking, obviously. Phoenix right. It's her! <laughs> Congratulations on the victory, your lordship. The entire vessel was impatiently awaiting the news of your expedition success. The rumors about you not simply saving the tech priest's monastery, but actually eliminating the source of the mutiny are spreading like wildfire. The Vox transmissions from across the world speak of nothing else. 
Ever met Aeneas, expecting you at his command center to discuss matters. We are ready to depart immediately. Just give the order. Yeah. Also, Ek, I was right. They did nerf my cape. Yeah. Mm. It no longer adds the plus five temp wounds. Um, I'm gonna do something campaign Boom. What? I was looking. I was looking for something else, I'm gonna send this to the fans, but this this is a really interesting series of events that I've found. I will look at that once I am free to do so. Yeah. Go on, Michael. Um, you know what? Just for now, until I... could you hand me over, um, you... yeah. Yeah, go ahead and respect me for now. I'll deal with it off camera uh, later, and I'll just use Cassia for now. Uh, okay, if you want to handle it that way. Yeah, um, I don't want to waste your time on this. I was, I, was, I was going to go and do this. I'd like to order shipping and transportation of goods. Oh, okay. Uh, so I'll start with the tech priests, and if there's anything that I can trade that is... Was it 500 or 200? I'll give to them. Uh... I'll hold on to everything else because I feel like trading for 100% value isn't worth it as a rogue trader. You know, you gotta upcharge everybody, you know? Uh, before you do, and the thunder. My, um, abilities. Okay, the where is range to take? Well, I can give get Michael the camouflage rope. You know, the, so you know, you know how, uh, you know how you said that was your first trading opportunity? I'm still able to trade with those people, apparently. So, oh, well, we yeah. got all our stuff anyways. <laughs> there is no harm in what I did, other than Captain, if you want to play it. Captain, it's imperative you give me the heaviest armor they got. Captain, it's uh, imperative you give if me I the find second any. heaviest armor they have. What if I give you both the heaviest armor? You know that would do me good. Hmm. They're interested in the same thing as the others, so we do not have I enough. I could sell some things. I could sell things for a hundred and get to the. Uh, hold up. Look. I Matic see. Boots. I could level theirs up a little bit. Hold up. Those the where's range Pimuno attack? No boots would be wonders on Hob. Is all I'm saying. I'm not leveling them up three times. I don't think that's happening. Uh, maybe, but everything I have is only worth a hundred to them. So, um, yeah. Don't we have Heretic trophies we can sell? Those were sold to the Mechanicus. We got more breed since then, I'm sure. We have not, not actually. Not enough to fill it, I see. I can oh. sell things that are worth a hundred to them. Yeah, at least get for us a to bit. 150. Yeah. Or 1,500. No, yeah, I'll trade. I'll trade to that, and then I'll see what else we have. So I can get us the the force bomb, grenades, med force the med kits. Yeah. Uh, somebody can get a power mall if they want to use that. Get um, all of it. Just get all. Yeah, I know. Uh, I'm just looking at what it does. Is that a uh, two-handed flamethrower? Oh, one. Yes, it is. <laughs> Oosh. Um, and then... What's the Reaper cape? Grants 12 dodge reduction to where's melee attack. It has a range of six, which is... A um... I don't think that right now, with our current profit factor, it's worth leveling them up anymore and trading any more hundreds because oh, we can no, find no, no. The, uh, people oh, that'll yeah, buy no. that for more. Yeah. So for now, we will call that. So they have the exact same. They have the exact same desires, except wait, they like jewelry more. Mm -hmm. That is the only difference between them. Is is the pre the priests like or they don't care about jewelry. So. Our main trade to them is going to be primarily jewelry. Yeah. Uh, uh, and no, you wanted me to respec your no, character? Not yet, not yet. Let me take a screenshot of what I have on, so that way it's easier for me uh, later. Okay. Get out, get out. I shall read the instructions, Lord Captain. Uh, 
Also, you will. Or, oh, wait, no. Not you will have levels. I forgot that's. Uh, I can't hand control right now. Uh, Kaylee. I'm going to drop my. My metronome. Go ahead and take that. Um. Now, that being said. I do believe. I do believe. Michael, that you'll want to throw on the the camouflage robe. Camouflage robe? The wearer's range attacks decrease their target's dodge by five, so you'll hit more often. Oh! Oh, that stacks, doesn't it? Uh, I'd assume so. Nice. So... Go ahead and put that on, I see. Michael. Um... It says does not stack. So you can't hit what the same target stack? like three times. The camouflage robe. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. I, I will see. Say, what does Katie have? Because the one I have is also pretty good. It what? increases my uh, dodge by twenty percent until the end of combat. I don't have a cape. Oh, you don't have. Then, yeah, oh, you, I you thought you already cape. had a cape. Okay, yeah, Kaylee, you go ahead. No, and no, no. That. I did. I did. I did. Sorry, I forgot you gave me one earlier. Phantom cloak. Uh, armor against warp damage. Uh, I don't know if Pascal has one. No, he doesn't. Give it to Pascal. Okay, then, yeah. Uh, well, Pascal's not always going to be in our group. That's fair, but I think dodge chance is better because I already and it's have a plus five percent chance. To it's a, it's for damage. it's for ranged characters. Mm, okay. It only applies to ranged attacks. Hey Ryan, check Rock V's uh, parry. Check out V's parry. Let me find V real quick. Uh. <laughs> Wait, sorry, which one did you want? Pascal to equip? Uh, Pascal can't equip cloaks anyways. Ye so, don't even bother with that, apparently. Uh, it's he a can secret of the rogue pieces. trader's cloak for some reason. He's a rogue trader now. to put it on. Huh? He's missing the cloaks, or he's missing the cape section. Or am I looking at the wrong spot? Oh no, I'm looking at the wrong spot. My bad. Look at him. Yeah, he can put it on. Look at how stylish uh, he is, man. Yeah, if you want to put that on him because that gives fellowship, I don't know. How Pascal, my favorite be. charisma man? Yeah. Um. Does he have analyze? You could also put the, the analyst helmet on him if you wanted. That'd probably be good. On Pascal. Um, uh, yeah. anywho. Uh, let's move on now and head back to where we need to... Oh, wait. Michael, you want me to uh, respect your character, right? Yeah, I just don't know why... Uh... Oh, wait, no. I think I have... Okay, no. I do have a screenshot of all of it. You're good. Okay. What you can do also is, like, you can save... Y you can save the game, Snake, and have, like, a copy of what it is now. That's what I'm gonna do after he respects me, so I can actually uh, go in and change it myself later, so I know exactly. Okay, so cool. I need Prometheus to be respect. Oh, oh, that's gonna cost me a profit factor. Is it? Yes, I've hit my max respects. Alright, well, I guess. Do we want to hit a profit factor for that? Nah, it's not. It's full profit factor. Okay. Moving on. So can we only do that so many times? It seems like it, because that was the fourth time. Oh. Either that, or we progressed far enough that we can no longer respec without... without, uh, costing us. I see. How unfortunate. Alright. That's fine. When we're super rich... Oh, wait. I'm playing Iconoclast. <laughs> no, you're primary iconoclast. We primary. still got a bunch of stuff from the governor and whatnot, but... Yes. Well, that's... That's fair. Um, let's go ahead and head back to the bunker. Uh, Put me in, coach. We can take out Heinrichs and throw in Rock V. Uh, oh, you can take out Pasquale now. Pascal. Do we want Pascal or Cassia? I think I'll leave Pascal for now. Because this is the planet he's from. I think he was just visiting this planet. 
but I mean, this is the planet where he has ties. Mm. Well, well, no, we're talking to the Cass governor. Also, I think Cassie would be better for that. The, uh, Cassie has literally been trained yeah. from this place. They were in the, uh, whatchamacallit station. I'm probably going to duck out if you, like, you're more than welcome to take Hob, and I'd like you to, but I'm probably going to duck out. Uh, I'll just leave us with the one NPC. Okay, see ya, Ek. Cool. Bye. Um, I think we'll take Cassia for now. Alternative. Just because I think... Want, you can leave Prometheus on the ship and make him still out fast as well. Okay, yeah, if you want to do that. If that's what you really want. I rather have Prometheus and Cassia. Yes, okay, I want then... Shooting ability, but we already have a good shooter. D make a decision. It's your character. If you want him in, where he's staying in. Sure. I'm only deciding between the NPC. Sure. Okay. Then we're going to take Cassia, because I think that she's going to be more valuable when talking to the minister. Yeah, probably. Especially seeing as I don't know if I want to bring the tech priest that threatened him back. <laughs> <laughs> probably not a smart idea. That is fair. Oh shit, I need to level them up. Oh, yeah. Ryan, did you see what I sent, by the way? Uh, I will do that while Michael's leveling up once I give him control. Uh, give me control yeah. too. Let me just get out of the way here and just let me test it. It's as good as done. <laughs> I'll see to it personally. Um. That's all it takes. That is literally all it takes. I see, I see. This person did six rogue trader flames. I'm looking up some information on some other stuff right now. Um, I did not open OBS, but I need to leave that there. Okay. Oh, wait, I forgot. Who's controlling Hob? Not it. Katie. Oh, okay. You want to control Hob? Uh, do I ever? There, you have Hob now. Thanks. And once they get leveled up, we'll talk to the incompetent governor. Wait, is he not... I don't see him here. Uh, you looking the right way? But maybe it's just because he's in a fog of war effect. Probably. He 100% is there. Okay. I didn't run up Astro because I didn't want to risk triggering a, a cutscene on Michael. It was going to be a cutscene. Oh, wait, that's right. You've already played up to this. What does it mean by line of sight? Though? Line of sight. Oh, if I the see. enemy can see you. So, if I take this, every enemy in the navigator's navigator has in their line of sight as its dodge and hit chance reduced by two times navigator's perception bonus. And what is my perception? Yep. It is currently 65. <laughs> so so plus, by 6. Yeah. So that would be a total of 12. Which sounds pretty good when you think about it. What do you think? Sounds alright. Pick whatever you want. I'm not controlling them, so... No, I know. Trying out of like options here, I'm just trying to think. I got a power mall. Hmm. You have a power mall on now? Yes. You like the power mall? I don't know, I haven't used it yet. Uh, 7 to 10 damage, it has a power swing. Maces and hammers have a special attack that push enemies away. I'm assuming that's the power swing. Oh, or so no, the Dakari weapon proficiency? That's some BS. 
Even my strength what? ain't 60 yet. What? It's a car weapon. Oh, oh, it's a heavy weapon. <laughs> yeah. yeah, my my strength is 50 right now. <laughs> yep. And your car. Yeah, weapon. yeah, weapon proficiency. I'm just saying, 60. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> you gotta be dedicating for it. 40. But I have weapon heavy proficiency, so I might be able to. If I have. No, you, but you need, don't have um, drunk car. And strength 60. Okay. Weapon, weapon Hover over for yourself if you don't believe me. I don't want yeah. <laughs> you 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 need Drakari weapon proficiency. Yeah, no, I know that one. Oh. Yours might be lower with your weapon or heavy weapon proficiency. It should lower Boys, up by Always keep your eye on the price. Either that or that was mastery, and I'm just mixing things up. No Why am I not surprised? Anyways, are we ready to continue? It is my destiny to traverse the unknown. Are we ready? Mm hmm Okay. Let's go talk to the incompetent governor. Greetings again, your lordship! I can't express how grateful I am for your help. Now that the insidious heretical des uh, designs have been thwarted, nothing stands in the way of my pl of my plans or yours. With the war dead, the spirit of revolt is waning. The in uh, entire squads of rebels are surrendering. We are witnessing the final days of the uprising. I have already signed the order to allocate 2,000 first-class void flowers to you. Their transfer to your ship should begin any minute now. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, I would also like to salute the savior of Rikard and uh, uh, Minoas. And I have already a festival celebration to be held in your honor. We will celebrate your victory with an ancient custom, the Triumph. You will drive through the city streets accompanied by a guard of honor. It's uh, as a hits a hero uh, who has vanquished the Imperium's enemies, while your trophies will be displayed to the jubilant crowds. Let me know once you have concluded your business in the system and are ready for the Triumph to begin. Uh, Governor Medina is positively ablaze with enthusiasm. I can't... Is I have business in the other system allow me to just leave without parading myself? It means... It, it basically means you're not ready yet. Yeah, it will let you do anything you want to do before you are ready. There's I nothing will, else left to do. I will stress, this is a point of no return. But there's nothing left to do. Alright. Then do it. Do it. Like, hold up. What else do we have? We have Rykad I, I don't know. That's why I'm saying this is a point of no return, and this is our last thing we are doing. Okay. Then do we want to go to the void ship and see if there's anything else, and then come I back? There is not anything else on the void ship. Then there's nothing else to do. Then there's ball. Right. Yeah. Uh, I am. This is uh, this isn't we how Kane would be. I. I... Back, remember? Yeah, I know. Yeah. What about it? that you know there was anything else. Yeah. Okay. Um, anyways. Um, I just wish this was a moment where Kane could be like, I have other business, and then just leaves instead of celebrating. Oh, no, no. You have to do the triumph. Sad. That would be such a Kane power move of just not showing up to his own celebration. Uh, I'm ready for my triumph. Excellent. We'll see each other at the square, then. May the light of the throne be with you. I always okay, where do I go for this open. triumph? Uh, back the way we came. I see, to the upper way. Yep, can't go back to your void ship now. This is a point of no return, like you said. There's nothing else to have done. We were kind of thorough already. As far as I know, yeah. If not, we'll find it in another run. Exactly. 
I'm not worried about hitting every single piece of content. Yeah. Otherwise, this would be crazy, and I'd have three different saves, and we'd be going through every single choice, heretical, dogmatic, and, and iconoclast all at once. Yeah. Look at them go. Look at you go. Talk to the Master of Ceremonies. Okay. Who's doing her? No, because I think I'll have a different speaking point anyways. Your Lordship, uh. Peerless Lord Von Valencius. I am the Master of Ceremonies of Rykad Minoas. Everything is in your power for you, or everything is in place, sorry, for your triumph. Allow me to give you a brief summary of the upcoming event. Uh, I don't like either of these, so speak. You will take the road now familiar to you from here to, uh, to the starport. You will be accompanied by your comrades in arms and a guard of honor. The body of the heretic known as the Prophet Aurora will be pulled in your wake as a battle trophy. A stop is planned in the middle of the road. There, grateful citizens will rush towards you, praising you for their salvation. They will also take anything of value off you. What was that last part? Um, that's what I expect to happen, at least. Um, not to worry. There's, uh, this is a thoroughly choreographed interlude. The group of the grateful people will be composed exclusively of loyal citizens vetted by us. Members of the military, young people, attractive and physically fit, a few healthy children. Get those children away! Uh... Ooh. 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 I have a choice here. Uh, once, uh, once they have said their praise, the procession will move on. Governor Medina will await you by the starport. It is also there the pyre has been b uh, built for the burning of the body of the heretic known as Aurora. You will be handed a flamer blessed by a representative of the, e of the ecclesiarchy. You can choose to personally perform the burning, but if you wish to underscore the amicable alliance between House von Valencius and House Winterscale, it will be fitting to pass the honor of burning to Governor Medina. However, the choice is yours. This is disgusting. I, I do not want a staged show of gratitude. Allow the ordinary people of Rykad Minoris to speak to me or skip this farce altogether. Uh, the Master of Ceremonies' eyes widen. My sincerest apologies, your lordship. No thought could be further from my mind than incurring your anger at the, uh, ordinary people, though, you say. I'll see what can be done. Kane under his breath. Thank God I got the children away from me. Hold <laughs> 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 up. <laughs> oh, wait. Let's level Let's yeah. level some of our characters up real quick. We yeah. all got levels. Let's not jump to conclusion. I have maxed out my intelligence and willpower. What do I level now? Perception or ballistics? Um, both are... What does perception do again? Uh, it describes how well characters with higher perception can pick out stray. You can tell when somebody is being deceitful. It increases... Or it also affects their awareness skill and reduces dodge. Ballistics would be all ballistics. The base hit chance... I'm going to do perception. I'm going to rely primarily on my psyker powers. So perception it is. As for I things got, here... I got more strength. Um... Um... No, regaining that's not going to help me right now. Um, I don't need this right now because I don't have anything super helpful. Mm. No, I don't have anything right now that could potentially do that. I think that's 1 AP. Yeah, that's 1 AP. So, uh, Or not 1 AP. Uh, what do I need to see? That is... I, I need more information. I don't know how much... Veil degradation that costs. 
I guess I'll go ahead and put it on. It doesn't hurt. Um. Yeah, it can't hurt. So I'll do that. Oh wait. No, I didn't mean to do that. I messed that up. Hold up. Perception. Throw that back down. We will do stabilizing factor and apply. Okay. 60 ballistic skill. Let's go. Fuck it. I'll leave my ballistics as is. It's not letting me go with 55 weapon skill, and I'm sad. You might be able to with your next set of ability upgrades. I'll be very glad. Because I need my... 60 right now. Should I... Actually, maybe I should do willpower, because without my... Eh, maybe not. Uh, willpower or fellowship? Fellowship's at 57, willpower's at 60. Uh... She's currently our best fellowship, but she's not always with us. Yeah. Keep, keep her for keep her with the fellowship thing, or is she? I think she's our best fellowship person. So yeah, so yeah. Keep up, bump up her fellowship. Yeah. All right. And we'll use her whenever I think we're gonna have a lot of negotiations. Yeah, or talking or whatever. Yeah. And I think if they're just honor, uh, thing or trading, because I also have trading up for them. Okay, yeah. Continue that then. I'm doing... And... What, what I'm trying to do is heavy officer, but also dangerous-ass fucking uh, navigator. Allies are targeted by navigator's abilities in a five plus five to all resistance checks against warp effects caused by demon psychic powers, navigator's powers, etc. until the end of combat. The effect stacks every time every applied navigator ability. That's kind of fucking good if we're fighting demons. With uh Cassia on our team. But they're not I, I doubt they're going to be here that often, so. I do think it's funny that initially I mocked them having random people approach us. <laughs> and then it's like, it's like, it's all choreographed, so don't worry. It's all people we've selected. It's like, wait a second, that's kind of fucked. Oh, whenever the navigator uses the navigator ability, veil degradation is reduced by one. I would, I would like it if you were to take that. It's either that or strange vitality, which is the navigator heals six wounds at the beginning of every turn and gains plus one additional wounds for every navigator talent taken. I, I want veil degradation reduction. There's still blood on the walls. Oh wait, the blood disappeared. Okay, never mind. Okay, we all ready to move now? Um I believe so, your lordship. Astro Kaylee. Uh, nine, Go on. Six. Hold on, let me just Kaylee. think real quick. Ready? I'm I'm thinking okay. if I want the plasma uh, wait, pistol hold on. or if I want the flamer. Plasma pistol has a range of eight. If I'm gonna be in cover for now, then I guess that makes sense. Eh, I could take it. Can't you? A or B. Uh, I'm gonna say A. Oh wait, no! I could take the flame one, leave the arc rifle, and the tech meters could use the arc rifle. Katie! Oh wait, no. Hey, Katie. Huh? What? Not Those really He's sometimes. not here. <laughs> what? Never next mind. time. Ne next time. No. Next. Next time that you, uh, next time you get to play the Tech Priest, you're gonna have an arc rifle. Yep. If you wanna use it. Honestly, this arc rifle so hasn't good. done anything but cause me fucking problems, so... <laughs> I don't That's mind. That's just cause you keep missing. <laughs> Let a Tech Priest take a look at that. 
Oh, Anyways, that's fine. I let us the move. In a heavy, uh, in a heavy I'm fine. Are y'all? Let us not dawdle. Are y'all ready? Uh, Katie, you ready? Mm. Yes. Uh, I'm sorry, Ashley, I was. The Astra? Astra. 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 Astra's oh. moving. Oh, Astra triggered it. Astra. Oh. Listen, I said it the first time. We should have just kept going. Here's the thing. They Look at him! The corpse first. There was a interaction there. Eh, it's just a corpse. What is Kane doing? A tank? Oh, Wishing he wasn't here. Yeah. But he's waving to the crowd. He's a people's person he for real. He, like he saw it all the. Kane. Oh, there's a second thing that all Kanes are about. They are not a celebration person. Who's doing this uh, one? Hello, you lordship. Glory to you. Glory. <laughs> Molly group only... of modestly dressed people. Uh, hurry towards you. I read that in my head in the, um, actually, <laughs> voice for some reason. Who's the master, or of Sarah? Oh, wait, it's me. You! Right. Uh, Silly the person. grateful citizens wish to present gifts to their redeemer. The master of ceremonies sugary voice almost brings a taste of honey to your mouth. I can't do a sugary voice, so that's the best we're getting. Sounds like the opera. Kidding. For whatever reason, you know for certain that uh, right at the moment the gaze of Aurora's dead empty eye sockets is fixed upon your the back of your head. A thought surfaces in your mind, not a voice inside your head, no, a mere thought. They are all going to die, befuddled, deprived, never having seen the truth. And it is all because of you, enemy mine. Um... Did I miss an opportunity to talk to the corpse? Astro. It's I not important. To continue. I'll continue, but I'd like to make those decisions in the future. Aye, um, aye. I'll greet the people for now. Uh, it is my pleasure to protect an Imperium world and its honest inhabitants. May the light of eternal terror shine on us all. Uh, Reich Edmund Norris honors the Emperor and bows to his most loyal servants, the rogue traitors. Uh, I'm sensing something. Palmas, blue, gold, dark. Sink. It depends on There's, whose voice it was at the time. I think three different people I, the voice Astra heard. was, I think, the last voice. So you should rotate. Who's next? Yeah, Michael. I was in any <laughs> I'll do it just for just for you, Snake. Alright. <laughs> Wait, why is she cheering me? <laughs> yeah. yeah. You're down okay. Down. Yeah. Yay! What? <laughs> okay. Behold! Behold! Behold the final dawn! Oh. Open heaven. Oh. The flower move! Don't worry, Cap. I have one of those with my own. We'll be just fine. I see. Would I have been hinted to this if I looked at the corpse? I don't think so, no. I see. Yeah, I just lost the chance was... to talk to the corpse. Yeah, that's it. Hmm. It, it was, like Astro said, it's not anything major. Yeah, I just would have liked to have made the decision of skipping it. Or... Uh, every ten points in strength adds plus one damage to melee attacks, would you know? I want more strength. I need all the strength. <laughs> I might need a little bit more strength. Hey, look, another cutscene. That's a void chip. That's not a void chip. Oh. <laughs> I know what type of chips those are. Was that Drakari? 
I think there's an L dog, but they're very hard to L -dog. distinguish. Yeah. Hey, look, it's a sun. You know, the sun's getting 20. What? Left. Look at that. They're... Look how funny it is. Imagine being a lone kid playing, playing. You just look up at the sky. Imagine oh. that you have no tongue, and this is what you see. You can't tell nobody about it. Yeah. Wait. If that, if that is the Drakari, then that would explain why their ship was there, though. It probably is the Drakari. Drakari make more sense. So what is the difference between the Drakari and Eldar? Uh, Drakari Eldar, Eldar and Eldar. Eldar. Eldar yeah. Oh. Uh, mm -hmm. Just another name for them. Yeah, they're the Slaanesh warrior or uh, Slaanesh worshippers. Why can't warriors I speak work. today? Oh my goodness! I mean, to be fair, they are warriors. Bro, I was trying to read something about the game for like a minute. What happened? Uh, <laughs> the fight. So the, the sun has been destroyed. Oh, okay. The sun has been destroyed. Average VO behavior. Got gotcha. you. Uh, I think I. Astro, I was gonna uh, move, uh, Cassie over there if you wanna. Is move them over here. Move where you. All right, right here. Yeah. That that way I can uh, do the uh, what you call it first. Um. The, the all right. Fun. So the thing is, wait, you right there. Oh, yeah, all right. Come to try to limit out. Yeah, I'm just trying like, to eliminate them out many times I gotta move for the when the fight starts. Yeah, no, I gotcha. I I'm thinking me and you will take around back with Cassie and uh, Log B, um, Hob and Prometheus oh, over here on the right side. Uh, so, so. Main, fun, fun center. And then we'll deal with that. So, Ka so Kaylee, Xeno ship showed up. Uh, we don't know if it's Drakari or Eldari. I'm pretty sure it's Drakari. Oh. Um,. And Aurora's corpse started speaking to us about the final dawn, and they either blew up or took away the sun. Uh, uh understandable. So. You take the moon. You take the sun. And you take the moon. And you take the moon. And you take the moon. You know I haven't heard that in a long time. Not me. You haven't heard that in a long time? It's Michael's fault. I don't actually know the song that well. Oh, me neither. I didn't know it from Chowder. Speaking of taking the moon, uh, first off, let's start with the big book. On it. <laughs> I don't know how you missed everybody else, but. Because I'm doing this, what we call a boom. It's as good as done. I absolutely need to me. deal with the gunners on the gun. down. Nice work. <laughs> Look, like, like I said, just that mechanic is crap was holding me back. Now I got my proper weapon. And Alright, go get him, Victor. Let's go. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I apologize. This is not an ideal spot. Maybe? And then actually working on the left side, seeing how hard it's over here on the right side. Yeah, this is just a good angle for me because I can oh, see yeah. pretty much everything from cover here. All right. Um. Then yeah, stay. So if you want to stay there. Uh, take out enemies. Actually, mm, I should be able to deal with the enemies on the right. If you take out the enemies on the left, that would be good. Unless you want to t uh, uh, reduce some of the numbers on the right. Well, here's the thing. Me and Hob are already on From what right. direction? Are you on the right? I don't see you. Uh, it depends on how you're looking at it. I'm looking at this yeah. going forward. I will say this. Kaylee, kill the leader of the cult. Oh, Over yeah. There. That's a good-ass point. This oh, okay. Guy. Your end was inevitable. Nice. <laughs> Boom. You already broke the formation. Kill the leaders. <laughs> Is there any more one, leaders? No. So then, Who wants know. extra strength and toughness? I'll take it. Oh, you are lucky, that also works. Either no, no, we're lucky. Here's the you're thing. Lucky. I was gonna say do hop because I can get lucky. 
That's she. I think the world about to blow up. Nah, it already has. We good. We good. The sun's uh, now got 65. <laughs> I'm assuming we don't want to walk through the purple miasma there. Oh, absolutely not. Me. If you insist. <laughs> nice work. God, I love navigators. You know what also is funny? Ah, uh, I, damn it, I needed to get the other thing that would stop people from running. Oh well, it's fine. Um, there's a person behind us. You want me to deal with them or let them be? I want them to, uh, do this. Do I have permission to test something? What do you mean? I'm gonna do a notch of purpose on one of them, and I'm hoping they're gonna run past, uh, Asher's character. Yeah, go ahead. Isn't this a job for the serfs? Yes. No! They were smart! <laughs> Damn it! They gave me a Y, Murph. Well. I mean, they they gave me more places to move since they're like, like, they're not that bad. That's fine. They, they don't get to go. Force yet, her to do your job. Yeah. Bruh. Hey, go home. Uh, he shot him twice. Go home. This is bad. There's a lot of people. Oh. Oh, oh that, damn. Damn, that's a lot of innocents that just died there. Damn. Curse you, miscreant. Hub is now on fire. Always has been. Might I recommend dealing with the one that started that fire, Kaylee? The one that's so, yeah, actually, the fanatical old man! The mm. um, fire setting focus might be good for attack. Few minutes ago? I'm unfamiliar with like any of Hobbs' uh, abilities. You hit hard. Yeah. Oh. I'll open that then. Oh, you <laughs> I see. There you go. <laughs> Can't move after I'm attacked. Can Unless. you? You could Wait. charge him. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Back towards the other echo, you said? Either that or someone uh, in the more, more open. The panic. Oh, watch this. Oh, yeah, that guy. Looks. You didn't stand the chance. Like Alright, captive. Though. Captive. Start cooking, captive. Yeah. What you got? <laughs> Oh, we're, oh, Good okay. work, Captive. Honestly, that's oh, smart. You got to die. Go on, get him, Wakfi. This ain't gonna sugarcoat it. Why can't I hit you? Why can't I hit you? Because uh, you gotta I'm walk sorry. up. That's why I really tried to get them to run past you, not away from No, no, it's fine. <laughs> why glass will do so little damage? This just disgusts me. <laughs> that one did damage. Like it. <laughs> That's what I that is what I'm used to. Alright, how am I feeling? In team, in team, I ain't oh can't go over there. Okay. So I'm just gonna walk over here and prove a point. Okay, I'm proving a point. Strike me again. Proving a point. Sloth of despair. Bruh. Minus twenty <laughs> dodge. <laughs> Yeah. If I do this, this will remove. So I gotta move forward to do this. Okay, I'm gonna use the, my action to reduce the veil degradation, so we can continue casting spells. And I should be able to kill both these cultists and maybe three more. I see. Uh, goodness, if I walk around there, all of those cultists should get. I have a on them. Yes. If I do this. Another enemy down. Oh, it killed more than I intended. You accidentally killed all enforcement now. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're golden. It accidentally killed the target that was not intended to die there. Uh, that's fine. Um, Man. Man. This leaves 
me, because I was going to shock the guy that died right here. So that way I could kill this guy. I am now in a very bad spot, so... I will say all... No, everyone has Eye of Oblivion on them, except maybe... No, everyone has Eye of Oblivion on them, so you should have an advantage here, pretty much. What Eye of Oblivion oh. does is literally make it harder for them to hit us and uh, dodge us by 12. It's so, not honestly, better for... That combined with your skills to like reduce it even more might be really fucking funny. You never stood a chance. There we go. I didn't even see that guy there, if I'm being honest. That one I don't know guard who he's shooting lucky. at. Uh oh. No, I, I didn't even move. <laughs> <laughs> no, that one enforces is him. Yeah. Oh, that <laughs> guy is in. Okay. That oh, guy no, is in. <laughs> what do you think? Oh, there's there? another? Okay. I didn't see him all there. Get him. Ooh. Oi. Oi. Hey. <laughs> Don't worry, Hob can take it. That was Hob. Victor's fine. What? He would never get shot. Whoa, what's going on? The guy had a friend? The guy had a friend? Oh. Oh, uh oh. Oh, good heavens, whatever I, will I do. Hey, would you like me in to use my ability and help you out here? Yes, please. I am right in their line of fire. All by myself, too. I can't get all of them. I can't get all of them. I could. The best defense is a good offense. Then. Permission to use the funny? Yeah, permission to use Accept the funny. Make good value. Um, if I go back to here, I, I, I refuse. Okay, fine. Yeah. Is, it, is that that guy here? Is it On it. To try and attack one? Oh no, I can't see the right I'll see to it personally. Um, just gonna I'll make it happen. Using zero AP. And gonna, gonna I'll trash. see to it personally. I see. Do right. your thing. Well, um, I wonder. So I have two different heroic actions. I wonder if using one still allows me to use the other. <sighs> nice shot, by the way. Thank you. The sheer damage numbers make me so. Now, mm -hmm. now I'm not saying I should, but. Ah, shit, I forgot to Prometheus my is looking. Pistol. Prometheus is looking a little low on health. Uh... Up to you because Cassia will be going next, and if they use literally any navigator ability, a veil degradation is going to go down. Right now. I mean, this would this would perhaps cause our veil degradation to go up a, a good bit. Did you so. not get the thing that lowers the cost? No, I did not. Mm. Yeah, when the next time you get a chance, you might want to invest into that. Uh, Please, it's up to like, you. message me what it's called because I legitimately looked for it, couldn't find it. But now nah, I'm not gonna play it risky. Okay. You need healing. Oh, you fools! Yeah, but I'm. Yeah, but I'm the healer. What? I can't what? heal myself. That's not how it works. It is Cassia's turn. Uh, how do I do this without running? You know what? Fuck, it's okay. Actually, should I? Listen, do... Rock V is making a making a statement. She gonna walk through this. They gonna see her unfazed, and then she gonna kill him. Yeah, 
What I need is that enforcer to not be there anymore, but it's fine. Oh, that's not fine. Get highly depend. First of all, um, uh, you know, even if we knew about the Xeno plans to take the sun. I don't think there's anything we could have done to stop that many ships on our own. No matter. <laughs> this was just doomed to happen. I mean, if you sent in a... Uh, I'm just saying. If Lady Theodora was still alive, she would have stopped it. I'm just saying. I won't take this disrespect. Katie and Asher, who would benefit from a big officer push? Uh, probably them because they have a sniper and more range. What? What do you want me to do? Uh, then again, I could get one of your fucking You know what? This would heal for this. So, uh... If I may. What does voice of command do? We'll see. An officer. Do something funny now. Do something funny. Do something funny. Uh, I see. Uh, <laughs> funny. Oh wait, um, I, I was gonna say. Oh, that's for me. I don't want to shoot him. Uh, if you might want to take out the cultist that's by the other cultist here. That or the Norgian cultist. Which one? Uh, this one. No, this guy. That was who I pointed to. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah, that person would would be a decent please, shot to take please, out. Please, please, please. Sorry. Thank you. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah, that looks good. I also have a ninety-five percent chance to hit. So. God damn! You're hitting crit after crit. It's not one of these words. I will say. The fanatical old Thanks. man over here, he's got to go at some point, but until that point, I'm going to move Cassio well, up. No, he's on our side. No, he is not. He threw a yes, fire he is. At us. He threw a grenade at the acolyte cultist over here. Did he? Yeah. Oh, he's green. What the fuck is wrong with that? He, oh my god. He wasn't him. That being said, uh, that clears up what I was about to do. I now don't have to fear him being killed. There's so many fire starting cultists. Jeez. Mm -hmm. Okay, no for now. I did not hurt me. In a way that matters. <laughs> she has the smartest person here. Yeah. Anyways. Yeah. Certainly smarter than us that's actually opting to fight. Mm, maybe in stats, but I don't know. If I were one of them, I'd want to get out of this. I mean, the sun literally just disappeared. Thing is, we can't really move anywhere without finding a way out. That's fair. Found his cool gun. I'm gonna use the cool gun. Oh, you just said. We were going to give that to to to. Oh yeah. No, I'm I was gonna say if you want to. I was gonna say if you want to keep it, I'm not even against that. Consider this is me playing around with it. Another enemy down. Okay, so my options here are quite limited. I think taking out that fire starter is the way to go, though. Um. Yeah, I think. I'll analyze this guy here, so he'll hopefully take more damage. I will do my... Your was inevitable. Didn't quite kill like I was hoping. 
Um. Kaylee has a decent chunk of health. Um. Even though I was scared by how low it was. You have a lot of health. I am going to do Michael. Hmm. Michael, do you need dodge or are you fine? It'll cost one Veil Degradation. Michael? Yeah, go for it. Okay. Ow. Enforcer? <laughs> Fanatical old man. Oh, that oh that old man cooked doing numbers. <laughs> that old man's cooking. Yeah. Yeah, Prom Prometheus, a few more status effects, why don't you? <laughs> Pardon me, sir, but you can't put another status effect for your other status effects. Yeah, what? Uh, who's um, there's a guy down below where the stairs are. He just got shot by the old man. There's and there are two up above. One's nearly dead. Uh, one of them's a fire starter. The other's behind cover. Oh, You're calling that oh there's starter. there's another one down there. Uh, oh wait, there's no yeah, there's only two down there. There's a fire starter up above and a fire starter down below. Oh, I see him. You call that a fire starter? Oh, let me show you a fire starter. Well, 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 isn't it the red and it's. Oh, god damn, that's right. <laughs> Those on you. Burning is what I want. This means nothing in a grand scheme of things. Guys, guys, who gave them a flamer? <laughs> nice. This means nothing in the final day of dawn. You mean nothing. Yeah, we'll say that to the golden dawn when you meet him in your This is good as done. No. Oh! <laughs> and, um, I can now Who, level in Sodom, me. which doesn't really do me much good nowadays. <laughs> I faced worse than this. Well, I'm in now a the burning is over. Unfun position right now. Oh, no, you're By unfun, I mean no one is in my line of sight. You can move and shoot yeah, somebody. Yeah, but. <laughs> yeah, I'm not very fond of being set on fire. Uh, that sounds like a personal pumpkin. Um, yeah, sure. Oh, that's not. That's not a percent chance on us. Um, you have nonstop crit. God, I know. Damn. I got that. I got that. Uh, I got that dungeon master kind of look. All right. Is it pay that type of look? The what type of look? Don't worry about it. I have a question to ask after this combat. Unrelated to the combat. The navigator is coming. Okay. Over here. Emperor, give me strength. No, oh, how perfect. Ooga booga, ooga booga, ooga booga. Second thing, second. Asher, you think you can get to him if I give you an extra? Uh, it won't let me run towards him, but yeah. I could give it all to Ayn. Wait, you, you, you use an order something? I, no, 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 no. I can um, give Ryan the ability to use a totem. No, oh, can, yeah, give it a Ryan. He's a psyker. That would give me enough I to. I am uh, a navigator, him. not a psyker. Or should, with two turns. That 
I appreciate the thought. <laughs> All right, Captain. Him? What you gonna do next? I think it's Rock V's turn next. After oh, the captain. captain. Oh no, that would hit Victor and Kane, and I think also no, it wouldn't hit Prometheus, but it would hit just about everybody yeah. else. Michael, what you do? I have fifty-eight hit points. <laughs> I have fifty-eight wounds. <laughs> If I didn't realize I didn't, I just had barely under what I wanted to do. If I had one more action point, I could have also made it your turn. Whoa. Snake, what mm. happened to your health? Who? You! Who? Prometheus. Prometheus. Cassius, <laughs> I wasn't asking about Cassia, I was asking about Prometheus. Okay, Boga. Oh! I thought that was normal for you! Sword. Oh good heavens. Uh your calm beat comes alive. Vigdus's voice struggles to get through the thundering static. I don't know. They're struggling. I don't know how to read half of this. Struggle. Like they are. Very well. <laughs> Lord Captain, this is a box of math. Big dis. Please stand. Okay. Send it. <laughs> that was okay, perfect. We'll we'll immediately fun. send a. Okay. <laughs> I, I know what she's trying to say. I just don't know what she wants us to do. Um, We should probably head to the starport, like, immediately. There you go. Uh, we, are, we are on route to the starport. Repeat. An otherworldly cacophony, which until now resembled the rumbling of distant cannons, suddenly swallows you with its full intensity. The warp energy seemingly burst out of thin air, rushing inside your exposed mind like an unstoppable wave of filth. For a moment, it feels like your head might explode, but then the sensation retreats, leaving in its wake a different one. That of someone's touch on your temples. <laughs> Hey, the fanatical old man! He's important to the plot! He's uh, important to the plot! Who, who wants to do this one? This was you You should have shot him. Was it me this, earlier? This is the guy you didn't shoot. Oh. Oh, it's him! Yeah, I see. So the old man peers at you gloomily. You told me my faith was false! You made me turn away from Aurora! Now what do you say, rogue trader? Who was right? Here it is, the final god. You should have shot him, but no, you wanted to keep him around. Uh, he makes a sweeping gesture with his hand. Who's doing this one, then? Hold your tongue, Galad. Done or no done, I'll die before they let those honest freaks maim me. So keep quiet and do as his lordship says. He'll tell us what to do. What, us, what? To you? What to you? What? <laughs> what? Huh? Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. I got a screenshot that. And that is and that is going in Rogue Trader off topic added at Eck. So he'll oh, see it for sure. <laughs> there. Eck will get to witness that. I can't have him miss that. <laughs> Black, red, black. Lots of blinding white fear. The whole city's quaking. Oh, the whole world. Vigdis, what is going on? King gives an appearance of the star form. <coughs> the calm okay. falls silent. Many stare at you. <coughs> um. <laughs> We'll start off with some questions. Does anyone have any idea what just happened? A show runs on your spine. You seem to feel Aurora's gaze upon you once again, only it is not coming from her corpse any longer, but it, uh, everywhere. I'm not under uh, any other okay. obligation to save any of you. Is every man for himself. There's one foot <laughs> on the ground. Make use. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
I expect every one of you to be my meat shields while I run out of here. I did save the planet after all. No, that's dogmatic. <laughs> um, we're not abandoning people in distress. Everyone come with us. I'm no fast walker, but I'll hobble after you. If you get into a fight, it's not like you want an old... Oh, shit. <laughs> Bro, keep it going. Keep the same voice. Keep the same voice. Keep the anyway, same voice. And I think there will be more fighting. Incredible. <laughs> there sure will be. It looks like some of my former comrades are still on the loose. The old man's Jack? voice sounds lethargic. Yeah. <laughs> Almost robotic. Still think it only applies to communists? Uh, the sense of alarm is now uh, almost physically drilling through your temples. The fleeting little whispers at the edge of your hearing are sinister and gleeful. All we can do now is try to make it to the starport. Uh, the old woman looks at you, not particularly hopeful and a little distrustful, as if she is reluctant to ask her question. The sense of alarm is growing stronger, as does the sensation of intent, uh, uh, of an intent gaze fixed upon you. That's it. Let's move out. Oh, wait, okay, wait. loot everybody. Oh wait, no, you're just over. I always have a backup plan. Okay, so now for a quick unrelated question. Um, yep. I wasn't here when you guys recruited Heinrichs. How was he introduced? He boiled somebody's blood. Until they died and then finished them. From the inside out, pretty much. A heretic, we should say. For... Yeah, definitely. Oh, I see. It's noted. Okay, interesting. I'm pretty sure he did that with his force sword. <clears throat> oh. Don't be stupid, you dumb! The world is full of colors I have uh, never seen before. Okay. Okay. I don't know why Kane did a spin there. Let's go. Well, for us losing the sun, I feel like things are going pretty well so far. I, I so wish I put two jackets. Yo, man. <laughs> <clears throat> See, now we're lucky the fanatical man didn't uh, didn't turn traitor because if that was the case, that would have been the switch to a more dogmatic cane. Yeah. See, am I running? Run? I think I told you I shot that man. I do I not regret a thing. I, I said his uh, <laughs> family would be fine, but he was getting shot. Yeah, exactly. I would shoot him again if you gave him the chance. Did he think? Uh, you vanquished Twilight. You cut down Aurora. But she was only one of us. You hear me? No. From the depths oh. of dead stone, from his prison of cold metal, he will rise. The hour is nigh. Nah. Oh, I think it's about eight. Is there money it's to like, be made? I can't tell the sun is gone. Yeah, I'm thinking it's like it's high noon. Oh goodness, now we rely on them to tell the time. <laughs> what time is, is it? Yeah, you know better. Nine! Oh. 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 oh, I'm kind of far away. That's the Wait. fucked up part. You see, the good news is I can move my characters backwards. <laughs> Don't worry. I, as the sniper healer, will protect you on the front line. <laughs> I mean, having uh, Cassie over here isn't a bad idea. Yeah, oh my no, god, let's there's see two we... chaos spawns down there. Fuck. Um, Alright. Broke cool. captain, I'm going your two back. Two chaos spawns where? Uh, if, if you keep moving over, towards the right downstairs. Oh, oh, shoot. Yeah, 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 yeah. We are... Lord Captain, I got you. I'm on your back. I got you covered. I have faith in you, so I will Jeez, go ahead and You got more faith I than I do right now. <laughs> I don't like how far I started away. I want to be right there. I want to oh, be yes, right in the tape. Wait, no, 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 no. Stay bunched up. <laughs> all right. All right, listen. I'm not going to get in front of Cassia. Instead, I'm going to get on this side of Cat. I'm going to be right here. I get right here, Snake? Yeah. 
If not, I can move Cassie to the other side. Goodbye. When is your turn? It's quite a while from now, so. A three okay. chaos bonds. Yeah. yeah, that's what yeah. I'm saying. Where, where? Hey, buddy. I count two shots. I lied. I only can shoot once. Damn. But you know what? <clears throat> you. Right now, I think I need veil degradation to go. No, no, not you, not you, not you. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Oh, that's lag. Okay. Now, if I would uh, move enough, you'd, you'd have to move up to, yeah. Yeah. You let me. Do it. <sighs> All right, Be careful not to cross my gaze. All of these guys. Um, me. me. If you try to die with grace, at least. I'm surprised that didn't reach further, actually. Anyways, you know what they say. Um, what do they say? Isn't this a job? The chaos. The, <laughs> the chaos. <laughs> the chaos right. spun is stunned as well. Yep. Hi. Um, He's a confused lad. Me? They failed their role. Um. I am going to move. I'm going to end up moving behind. <clears throat> Oh, Cassia for now. Can I? Um. Like the flash bang. We draw in and get her out. Yeah, <laughs> but the thing is, this is still pretty Out of line of sight. Don't worry. I will at least take out these two. Really down. Yeah. The thing is, I theoretically they could have taken out all four. Uh, and then you could have pushed the chaos spawn away and that's, done an attack yeah, of opportunity. That's exactly what I was thinking. Um, I, yeah. I, that uh, now after the fact. I did extra damage to the chaos spawn, but uh, I don't think there's anything else I can do. I could. <clears throat> once that fire starter move, uh, they've got a little bit. I'm not gonna use my thing. I'm gonna let the veil degradation go down a bit before I attempt to. Okay. Because my ebb and flow, um, every even yeah. turn, the navigator gains additional... Oh wait, no, it's every even turn I should give it. <laughs> every <laughs> odd turn I should choose, uh... Should I move up front and center? No, foot. As well. oh. oh, hobby. Yeah. Save Get in, Get in there and do some Nothing smash. hurts hob, only hob. I can do nothing from here, help. That is fine. You have done enough. <laughs> that one's not going to do anything either. Alrighty then. You think he has boss to speak? No problem. So what I'm yeah, they speak in many voices uh, of like the fallen and the dead, the ones that have been melded into the chaos on it. itself. You can also hear the darkest whispers of the dark tongue being spoken. So if you were to ask it what time it is... It would give you many answers. Probably the time of death of many that were incorporated into its horrible flesh being. Oh, it's like 12 o'clock. I got you. Yeah. Also, like, half of that was made up, so... I'll make it happen. That's all like Victor. Huh. Victor doesn't make it's stuff up. Good as done. Makes it reality. Let's try it. Make it happen. Damn it, I should have done that. He has decided it is now one o'clock. And the sun went out. 
<laughs> so you can see from this chart. There's some more further. I didn't even oh, yeah. know that. There's a, There's a leader too. Wait, that leader I think has a sniper. No, it has a shotgun. Okay. Oh. He could turn himself into a chaos spawn. Be careful. Yeah. I didn't even see a damage number. He just melted, and this makes me very happy. He was pretty dead to begin with, with me overcharging a plasma gun. Oh no, absolutely, but he's the only one I currently have line of sight on, so. Oh no, absolutely. Chaos spawn take extra fire damage and toxic damage, I think I saw. No, that's wonderful. It's a good thing I have thing mode. I could what be wrong. What is it with heretics in there? Like, saw. perpetual weakness to fire. Why, why are yes. all heretics weak to fire? Fire is a cleansing uh, substance. It suffers... 20% more toxic and fire damage. Yeah, because fire cleanses all the way. It is pure fire. Mm -hmm. Oh, and the more damage we do it to it, the higher its weapon skill. Ooh, it, that's I'd fun. Say it's also more effective on you too. Do you What's know Rock V's plan here? Astro? Astro? I think you're wrong. I'll need to leave after this cop up, by the way. Okay. There's not much more that we'll be doing, regardless. <clears throat> a chaos spawn. What? There's a chaos spawn? I was explaining that to Raven. Oh, I see. Hey, Hello, Raven. Raven. How's it going? <clears throat> Does my text bot not work anymore? Oh, it doesn't. That's lame. Cold. I have read terms of military tactics. It was so very cold. Raven, That's I too got cold. the I got the emergency national alert for the region, or not national alert, but like the the the, the amber alert style thing for the region. So I just thought of something funny, by the way, guys. Yeah. Mm. I could give someone a heroic act, and in addition, I can first uh, what I can first do. I could save me from moving them, but what I can do is give someone the whole uh, upgrade, the whole command upgrade, and then after all of that is used, I can use my hero. And what does that do? So essentially, I can give someone a turn of attacking and a turn of a um, a full turn. Right now, that might be best on Astro because he has a gun and. Uh, I guess if you put it on me, I can move up probably. Not because I would, I, have to use, I would have to use the bring it down first, which you don't get movement, but you gain momentum, and then I can use your give you an extra turn altogether. Oh, I yeah. see. Go ahead and do that. So, first of all, step you aside. Need a the navigator is coming. Oh, yeah. Isn't this a job for the serfs? Go on, Astro. Shoot it. <laughs> well, let me check something. No, let's not do that. That will not do me good here. <clears throat> I gotta send. Dude, in my high, in my defense, <laughs> in my defense, on a guys, on I have a dirty ballistic skill. That's fair. <laughs> right now you have a forty-five. In the name of Hansel Selig, <laughs> I shall prevail! 
Yeah, now you can properly attack it. What you do? I, I moved the other one closer, not this one back. <laughs> I see. I'm upset. Um. <laughs> I'm sorry, I tried to move. I meant to move it back as far as possible. Don't worry, he'll still die the I same. Finish the chaos fun nearest. Uh, so I wouldn't worry about trying to finish him off unless he goes before. The... Absolutely not. There's no way I can hit a shot. I do, but I don't have line of sight. Um, I mean, I can try. I have a chance to do it. It's not a guarantee. Um. Okay, we ball. Was this build degraded? Oh, exactly 23 damage. In this economy? <laughs> hey, I will... I will, uh... Work on lowering it. Um... Until then, who's gonna be the the, the in-the-face-of-the-chaos spawn? Victor. Me. Hey, Astro. <laughs> yes? Make it miss. Booga, booga! <laughs> I must destroy. Meanwhile, Hobbs turn. <laughs> Astro, did you like my choice of words? <clears throat> Make it miss, of course. Make it miss. <laughs> no, I'm not saying this is a good idea. That's a great idea. I mean, Old line. It's, it's fine. Oh, no. Watch and <laughs> Well, if I knew you were going to do that, I would have put it on you, Kaylee. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I didn't expect you to go down the stairs. But you know what? You're hob. You guy. You didn't scream. Sad. No, that guy praying down there. Ah, oh, crap. Uh, I'll, I'll do my best. Don't let your guard down. This way? This way? Uh, the leader. Uh, Despite all my heresy, I don't think I know any Chaos Bird. Ah, damn it, he's alive! Thank God for my oh. tip -down. Oh, there's a guy down there praying too. I see. We're about to have two more Chaos spawn. It's only a chance you'll turn into one. Not a Karen. That's fine. He's we stuck. Chaos spawn for breakfast, right? Oh, yeah. it's nice aim. Oh, oh, that's oh shit. Oh, that's so, oh, we need to get that guy. We also are at 20 degradation now because of them. What did his prayer even do? Oh, wait, wrong thing. Sorry, didn't mean to do that. Did it just fail to do anything? Yeah, um, it depends. The guy that's still on his knees, he's still praying. But the thing is, the thing is, what did the prayer do again? There's many things they can do. Yeah, I see that. Um, psychic phenomena, creatures healed by 10% of max wounds, nothing happens, and chaos spawn. Um, I think it was all a lie, and I don't think I actually have line of sight on anyone. <gasps> no! I do! Yeah, the guy over here under... Oh, no. oh, shit. Oh, nice! Not who I was expecting, but nice. It's who, it's who needed to go. Oh, no, absolutely. Oh, never mind. We're at max build degradation. Maybe not. <laughs> if uh, we get the next, if we get my next heroic action, I can reduce our build degradation. 
I mean, I would love to give yeah. Prof V some extra strength Victor and is toughness, real. but... I'd be alright. What about Victor being real? Raven, Raven's questioning Victor's reality. Yeah, Victor is real, and he's also my favorite psyker. Yeah, he's a psycho, yeah. Yeah, he's my favorite blonde. Yeah. What? <laughs> what does that even mean? Yeah. Somebody with no psychic really? powers. I. <laughs> okay, what you talking sick? Yeah, I'm watching. That was pretty cool. Where does he go? No. You can bit me. It did barely any damage, though. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, that guy did more damage than the chaos spawn did. Oh, hey, they're doing pretty good damage against There's a lot of Rock V's voice hit different when it's echoey. Emperor, give me strength. You don't have a way to use Linda Stare without hitting our allies. Hey, you don't know that. I'll be alright. You don't know that! Do <laughs> oh, never mind. Thank you for lowering the veil degradation. That's. Darn, that's not quite enough to give me. I am a navigator, not a servitor. Huh? If I may. Damn it! Uh, we can go far I enough. Have, I, I have to be so careful with what I do because otherwise it might choose a further away chaos spawn. I want them to get get you give an opportunity to attack on that. Uh I guess I'll move up behind here. Because I can't really do much more. Behind here? Hey. I will say what I is up? the degradation by what? Two or three? Three. As a um also, Nina, work. forget the guy on the left. Yeah, I know. Um, the problem is he is just out of range of my ability. The most I could do is try to snipe him. Uh, and we are just like one point short of enough. Yeah, we're literally one point short of me being able to reduce the veil degradation by five. So can't do anything about that. Do I want to do that or... Do I take out that gunner, or do I weaken the chaos spawn and do damage to the chaos spawn? What do y'all think? I think it's the chaos spawn death is guaranteed. Yeah, their death is guaranteed. Just whittle out the numbers. Yes, but... The, the reason why I'm saying that is because, remember, any excess damage I do goes to the next closest enemy, which would weaken the next chaos spawn. Not that much. No, it still uh, depends on how much damage I do. In addition to my eye of oblivion, that wouldn't be too bad. So then, which should I do? Should I hit the chaos spawn or that guy back there? Hit the chaos spawn because it will already have a minus twelve to dodge and hit chance. So, on top of whatever the bullshit you're about to do, this might just outright kill it. And a life. It nope. did not. Oh, so it's fine. Um. Oh, wait. Hold up. Did I misread one of my skills? Let me see something. I think I reduced Veil Degradation there. You did. By one. To 16. Wait. Wait. Do, what, what ability... What talent do I have that's doing that? Um. Hold up. Is that my... Stabilizing thing? No, it, it can't be that. Or, or wait, stabilizing factor. Yeah, it might be. Hold up. Uh, if this talent reduces the yeah. effect on veil degradation to less than zero, veil degradation is reduced by one instead. Okay. I can't so that is using the best experience like right here. Uh, what I could do is I could make that guy to the left useless as well, real quick. Oh yeah, please. I don't want a good shot. Either that or the cold leader. I don't have line of sight on cold leader. Um, and he failed, so he is deprived. So he has a one in ballistics and one in weapons. So we really so don't have to fear funny. him. 
<coughs> what? Because uh, I think that's with all you... of our things combined. Remember, he's also in the Eye of Oblivion, so... He has combined. a minus 35 yeah. in ballistics and a minus uh, I think the thing other. is, it has to be one. It can't get lower than one, otherwise it would be lower than yeah. one, I think. Yeah, it is. That's, that's true. Fun. Uh, finish him. I will do it on my when my turn comes back around. Yeah, uh, supposedly. I when combat started, I was like eighteen squares back, so I've been trying to move up the entire game. Yeah, <laughs> you were at I, max range I for your sniper. For this one. <laughs> Oh, not even close. Oh, I see. Was, uh, I see. <gasps> Snake, how could you? It's okay. Who if not me? Chaos spawn is basically dead. Oh! Bruh. <laughs> there goes all his health. Uh... What are you trying to do with it? Take out the leader? Uh, hopefully. Uh, save it. I'm going to use my thing to reduce the veil degradation to uh, max. That way Kaylee can heal you without potentially hurting herself or you. Assuming I have one so I... Or Assuming. I don't, I don't think I have to. Have we'll see. We'll see. Okay. I'm I'm starting to feel like uh, anytime I play Psyker from now on, I am getting I am getting uh, what's it called? I am getting uh, stabilizing factor every time. Yeah. How is Sweetie's tank getting so much damage? You did a lot of you did like 26 when you blew up. I thought. Oh, I blew up. I did not realize that. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That yeah, is, no. that is... Yeah, don't do it! <laughs> that is uh, precisely why I said don't use it right now, because I want to give Kaylee an opportunity to heal you. Nice shot. Is he dead? Okay, good. He's um, dead. And you... No! Snake is out what? of my range. I think it's because the angle of the staircase. Mm. That's all right. No, no chaos spawn will attack me. <laughs> It's okay, mostly because Hob is there to protect you. See, Rock V has this one, and Hob is in between yeah. me, the other one. See, fine. For some reason, I just got flashbacks uh, to the gorilla fight in Solasta. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> oh. That's not a threat. Who was he shooting at? Somebody. I think he shot at Hob. He missed Hob. What? I'm getting quite sick of that. Be careful not to cross my gaze. <clears throat> Can I hit Liberty? But this is an odd round, right? Uh, I, th I think so. You can check your stats no. to figure out. I didn't even know if it's four. It's not cool. Five. Where do you see where do you see the rounds? Round five because round six would be a, uh, Oh. No no it isn't isn't round four because the next mark is round five? No, because that's a clone uh, on. Oh I see I thought that was the next round. My apologies. So every odd is more perception. Oh wait. So it's buff people. I have five actually. Um, no, no, no. Perception would win. I would be better to do something. Battlefields are always drowned in scarlet. Ah, I see. Ah, I see. <laughs> then I have three to, uh... Did that stun? That stunned. Me? Something like this. If you insist, Lord Captain. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and I can snipe him, too. If he's oh, not nice. dead, so that's fun. Uh, with this angle, probably. Ah, uh, you're, you're too far away. But the oh, chaos spawns are gonna get to move. Know what they say, Prometheus. Get him. 
What did they say? It does do more fire. It does take more fire damage. Twenty percent. Why does the Liquid don't have so much rain? <laughs> liquid, like a like a. It's uh, a hand flamer. Now, no, I use that one's the, a full uh, flamer. Yeah, it's a full. Flamer. Oh, okay. Now should I use the fire mastery or no? Mm. Yeah, sure. Yeah, go ahead. You should feel honored to witness this. The veil degradation actually went down low come. enough, anyways. So. On it. Whoa, 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 whoa! Burn you, bitch! One more. It's gonna, it's gonna. No, 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 no! He's fine. Just. <laughs> that fucker should be crispy by now. Why is he dead? Oh mercy! Bless you. Bless me. I can't. Bless me in the. I, 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 oh my I god. To, I used to hold on for me. Yes. To be fair, I gave you and Hob an extra hit on the fucker. I need another hit, I'm addicted. <laughs> oh god, this chaos spawn has so fucking deep, many debuffs. Let's see if I can kill the leader. It, how is a chaos spawn disturbed? Darn. That's funny as fuck. It got set on fire, I'd be disturbed too. Probably just all his mind just confused at what's actually going on. Uh, well, I think it's because of Cassia. That stats are already low enough. Those stats are low enough. Yeah, the Chaos Spawn's gonna die next Yeah, so what I'm going to do is... Protect you. Oh, thank you. I can't kill the Chaos Leader. I took him down to 8 HP. Nice. That's about to be zero. Nothing of value has been lost. What? Why are you bleeding? No. Did you oh, run through the mist a bit? Uh, I didn't. Oh think no, I the did. chaos spawn. The chaos spawn. Uh, yeah. the chaos spawn caused you to bleed. I see. This is unfortunate. Unfortunate. So. You could walk away from me. Why do you have another turn? You thought you could just leave me. Oh, bunny boy, do I have He's as good as done. I will say my foresight does not protect from plasma guns overheating. That's okay. I don't need that. <laughs> Who if not me? The fuck? <laughs> <laughs> All right. I won't compromise my principles. Whoa! I can't. I wish I could. I literally had the thing that gave me a hundred percent. Oh wait, no, it's up. That's a hundred percent damage. Never mind. Why not? I thought it was a hundred percent shit, so yeah, I've been using it as that. Didn't flinch. Oh. Okay. Okay. All right. So first. I'll be watching this shaking her head. We're doing. Look, I'm just upset, you Astra. Okay. Your end was inevitable. Hey, we leveled up. We did. We did indeed level up. Oh, oh damn! I don't know what caused that There's one. Still one guy left somewhere. What caused yeah, that one? Right I don't know, here. guys. That's crazy. Prometheus definitely doesn't have more health than he did before, though. Oh. Oh. I didn't see that. Well, degradation did minus himself, though, in the At the start of every round, it minuses by one. Oh. And Honestly, I also subtracted by one. And uh, Kane's abilities together. Pretty good to keep Veil down. I still think that if you're playing Psyker, sure. sure uh, I still think that if you're playing Psyker, you kind of <sighs> should always have a uh, stabilizing factor. Unless you're playing Heretics, which <laughs> apparently benefit from it. So, you the amount of fence, I'm a melee build. Oh, that's okay. What? That's fine. You There's no damage. Shit. You <laughs> dare challenge I'm the I'm house of The one? I need you to house Arcelio. No, I just, no, <laughs> fuck, it hurt me. No, it's fine. I'll be right. <laughs> oh, I thought you were gonna move Astro with not your purpose. I was like, huh. Oh. You still got Astro. Oh no no no. Astro. Astro. 
Don't worry. Yes. No, but I sh if you did that, I'd have a psycho power and I should be able to finish him. Yeah, but I I'm the sniper right now. Like I that is fair. If you want to give it to, if you want to give it. <laughs> it's literally next. <laughs> Fifteen health should be. This should be enough to kill. I mean, Most there's a chance certainly. it doesn't, but it should be. There's no way it would. Do. Okay. No, there's a chance loot, for him to survive loot, by five. Loot! 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 Yeah, make sure we pick Get up the stuff. trash! Oh my fellow? Doesn't matter, it's to be sold. You like money, don't you, Astro? Oh yeah, I love money. Yeah. Well, I like getting good loot too. Yeah, but think about this as getting better loot for I'll later. Guide your vessel and lead you I want both of them. Dude, uh, I need to tell you this, right, but that ain't how go, it's gonna work. Let's go ahead and, um... No, yes, I'm just picking up loot. Oh, it tells me. Where is this last bit of loot? It's right by Hob. I must leave. Uh, uh see ya. I might wait who if that's the case. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Uh, was that Astro? If that's the, the case. I might hit I eat food. I think we've been leveling up and all that. Uh, a telepath staff, if anybody wants to use that. You might. I yeah. don't think I can. Uh, uh, hold up. Let me read what that does before I do anything. Uh, info. The wielder of the staff. Power level 9 gains the vision of death ability. The ability is also available in heroic and desperate. Power level affects the damage. Does that do the same amount of that is also plus 10 willpower i lose my lightning arc though um and then the telepath then gets what vision of death the target must pass a willpower test if they fail to suffer or if the test fails the target suffers psychic staff power level plus 30 or, or plus sight psych or psi rating plus 30 percent of the target's current wounds and mental damage if the target gets succeeds the target instead suffers Psyker's stave power level mental damage. That'd be nine? Hmm. Hmm. Do I double staff? Do I double dip? Hmm. How are you when it comes to, uh, Veil Degradation? Uh... Using one of these actions lowers Veil Degradation by five. I see. I need to test this ability before, because I'm not understanding what it does. The target must pass a willpower resistance test. The test fails, the target suffers uh, psychic, uh, psych, or psychic staff power level uh, plus psychic psi rating. So that's a plus one right now. Plus 30% of the target's current wounds in mental damage. That sounds like a very big one damage thing. Um, I see. So I could use that if we have one guy in particular that's pissing us off. I think I'm going to do it. I think I'm going to double dip. I think I'm going full willpower. Your your rogue trader is gonna be master psyker. <laughs> but not gonna lie, I'm gonna hit all e food. I okay. Uh, I guess I'll just end the stream there. But I'm gonna take this and I'm yeah. gonna put this in the fans.